Do you know she has a crush on my dad? Mommy doesn't know me. She was just kind of like... She doesn't know me. Welcome to the stream, guys. Sorry we're a little bit late. Um, that's, why, that's why we say 10 to 10 30. <laughs> Slayers, uh, Slayers, Lurk is, Babe Bigfoot is off to attend a Viking funeral. <laughs> Players remember you're lurking, that's like, okay, well, well a Viking funeral, alright, cool, that, that's good to know, I guess. Lurk. I forgot how many followers Bab had. 3.6k? I think she's been doing this for a very long time. It's awesome. I think it's great. I think she's been doing it for quite some time. Hey, Nadja. I forgot to get the fruit. Please hold. Just woke up. Oh, I forgot about you. You know, how's it going? I forgot about you. You did it. You did it. Oh no. I think my bio was dropped. Oh good. Waking up slowly. Oh. Yeah, waking up playing this and then Lance is gonna come over at some point. I think I have no idea. So he's gonna be here right here in the span of that. Oh, he has? Yeah. Oh. Uh, my grand or my grandparents came back from the airport. Uh, came back from Florida, so we had to pick them up. And we were hanging out and Chill. we went to uh, Texas Roadhouse because they were hungry. Which then <laughs> I had to um 
cats, but then when we went in their house, because we would have just come back here, but there were the pool noodles. And I put, like uh, we got them pool noodles, and so I put the pool noodles in their house. <laughs> like two were in like the guest bed, and then uh, uh, and then I put like two in their bedroom, and then like one was like doing stoke puzzle and was sleeping. Well, we waited for them outside. Um, so, it was in, so, I think my grandmother was like, what's in my bed? Or <laughs> who's in my bed? It was funny. Yeah. It was definitely funny. And then they brought back sand dollars for me. And then they brought back two, uh, action figures. Like, Batman action figures. Then, and my grandma was like, he should have gotten those for, uh, those for my little cousin. <laughs> I like action figures too. I still have Nightwing up in my room. Yeah. Someone gave me a, a Nightwing. Yeah. Okay. Jacob did. He got my Nightwing hats in my room. <laughs> so, they're back. <clears throat> the airports are always fun. I w when I went to Florida, when we had to fly, we didn't have to wear masks. Thank God. I don't know if I could be in. I don't know. If now. Not for the sheer fact that flying doesn't bother me. It's just I don't know if I'd be if I'd be able to wear a mask all day. Because at least when I'm at work, I can like go in the, I can go to the bathroom and take it off, or I can when I'm in the break room I take it off. So I have like times where I'm taking it off. You can't take it off at all when you're in there. <laughs> I would think they would still have that. <laughs> but even still, it was- I don't know if I'd be able to travel fly. I'd rather drive. Cause that way you can like kinda see things. Well I hate wearing that thing at work. I just get so hot in it. I mean, you were you can do it, which is good, I guess. I don't know. I just uh, I don't know if I'll be able to do it. But I think Main just did something. <laughs> no, Main just I think Main I think Main ended the the mask mandate, correct? Or look, well, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so our governor, our lovely governor, uh, she ended she ended the mask thing. So now when we're outside, we don't need to wear them, which I never wore it outside. But <laughs> step in the right direction. So we don't need to wear it outside. Um, and I think now it's up to businesses if. They want masks. So now it's up to businesses if you have to, if they want you to wear a mask or not. Our governor is, um, something. <laughs> exactly. That's politics. I mean, I can tell you later on in a call or something, but I'm not talking about history. Yeah, but I'm hoping she'll in a state of emergency. No. 
me know. I never wore my mask outside, though. <laughs> Yeah. We live in Maine. In the southern part of a small town. It's really not anything bad. <laughs> it's, it's, there's no... You might see one person when I bike in the cemetery, but, uh... Oh! Overwatch updated. Cool. Which I need to go biking again. I need to, because I want to go, I want to need to start the fifth volume. Uh, court record. Who do we have? Met Maya. Oh, she's 18. Okay. I mean, that's good, but we'll discount it. The, the Batman skin for Fortnite. No, I don't know. I don't think it is, but I don't like the I don't like the art style of Fortnite. I don't know. It, it, same with Borderlands. I don't like the art style of that either. Oh, you're welcome. Glad I can help. What a depressing rain. <laughs> do you understand how depressed that makes me feel, do you? <laughs> uh, yes. But actually, more than being depressed, I'm angry. Angry at the weather girl on TV. Why? I think our little rainy spell will break. Uh, we'll take a break on with the day of sun. Is what the girl said. I stick my I'd stick my life on it. <laughs> oh, that sounds good. Thanks for lurking. Well, it's the weather, but that's why I don't bother to bring him. That's why I didn't bother to bring an umbrella today. What nerve calling yourself a weather girl? She's going to hear about my $1,500 suit. Um, about your case. Unless you're planning on suing the weather girl. I'm sorry. I thought that before we get down to business, we could have some friendly chatter. Yes, because you venting about the weather girl's friendly chatter. the hell is that? Oh, a blood trail. Okay. Dr. Turner and Gray. I'm a surgeon. <laughs> Mom. What? Remind me to never end up under his knife. The guy's a surgeon. I'm here today because of this incident. Malpractice practice at Gray Surgical Clinic. 14 inpatients lose their lives. Oh, you're the doctor at... It's really quite upsetting. Do you hear me? Upsetting. Yes, yes, I heard you. I agree. It's quite upsetting, Dr. Gray. Turner Gray? Turning Gray? <laughs> I think that's what it's going for, at least. The one that screwed up was that nurse. I was rather called the, got the med that medications mixed up and killed those 14 patients. And yet, now listen good, and yet, the nurse had the nerve to go and die before admitting her wrongdoing. 
nice guy. She didn't even offer any sort of expl explanation to me. And that was that was the kicker. She up and herself. She up and herself. She up and has her, herself a grand old accident and crashed her car. Smash Crunch, instantly transforming her car into an accordion mo model. <laughs> That's right, a year ago, all the, da all the tabloid shows were talking about it. 14 victims of medical malpractice and the nurse's mysterious fatal accident. There were rumors that Dr. Gray had actually caused that crash. People said that it, would, it was to forever hide his, the person responsible for the malpractice incident. Um... Why would I? No, I'm just I'm just gonna say I'm just going to say this once. Why on earth would I want to kill that nurse? She's she's the one who killed those 14 patients, not me. I think you need to take a deep breath, Doctor, and focus. More to the point of the case over a year ago. Why bring it up now? That's simple because the situation is slipping out of my grasp. They just won't. They, they just won't do. The clinic isn't seeing nearly any any. As my patients nowadays. Do you understand what that means? It means they're not coming to my clinic. You don't say. For me, I don't think I'd want to go either. <laughs> so, what, what would you like me to do about it? I want you to help me prove I'm innocent. Um. You do realize I'm a lawyer and not a private investigator? No, this is not some. This is something only you can do. I was wondering how she was gonna get, get brought into this. Maya Faye, you know this girl, correct? Maya, why would he know Maya? I heard you were working under her a little while. For a little while. Uh, well, yeah. Hey, wait a second! I worked under her? Yes, am I wrong? She told me, so I'm not quite sure if... Well, we worked a few trials together. But she went back to her hometown to undergo more, undergo more training. Ah, yes. I don't trust you... in the slightest. Just so you know this. <sighs> ah, yes, I heard it must have been lonely for you. What? What? <sighs> what? I'm not... She must be an extraordinary girl to, hand to handle such rigid training. Huh? I have an acquaintance who knows a lot about those mystical sorts of things. She's the one who she's the one who introduced me to Miss Fay. Huh. Is Maya really that famous? And I've already set up an appointment. For what? What else? A channeling. I'm going to have her call the spirit of the nurse that went in and got herself killed. Oh. Maya, I wonder what she's I wonder what she's up to right now. We, the women of the Fae clan, have always been spirit mediums. It's because of the, uh, the, power to the power to communicate with the spirits uh, flows strongly through us. That's what she told me. I guess she learned to accept her, her, her responsibilities and become an adult. Not counting training, this will be her first time channeling her spirit. So she gave me... Uh, she gave me one condition of poor accepting my request. A uh, condition. The condition is you, Mr. Wright. She said that she wouldn't do a channel without you. Uh, without first seeing you again. Me. And that is why I... I've searched you out. You wanna see her too, don't you? And so that's how I ended up visiting my face hometown with the doctor. Who I don't trust in the slightest. He has creepy faces. <laughs> June 19th, 1.25pm. Curian Village. It's quite the village. Alright, I'll be right back, guys. Blowing my nose.
Okay. Can't see a thing, but that's okay. Or I can, it's just very blurry. And I'm very thankful for that. Uh, you can't see a thing? Yeah. Hmm. So this is Korean Village. <sighs> Maya's hometown. Pearl! Huh? Pearl? Yeah, I think it's either Maya's little cousin, I think. Oh, okay. Are you talking Pearl from what, Pokemon? <laughs> Pearl? Who's Pearl from Pokemon? Isn't Pearl? Isn't that her name? The one that took over Beauty the Pink? Opal? Oh, that was Opal, sorry. Oh, uh, oh, so. You can see that I know my Pokemon so well. Right? Oh, yes, so well. Yeah. Oh, uh, hello there. Hmm. So we're gonna, One. we're gonna be working with Pearl. I think this case we actually meet Dr. Hottie. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> Turn the guitar dancing on him. It's gonna be a pain. Um, hmm. One odd little girl. Uh -huh. Hey, wait up, Pearly. Hmm, someone's coming this way. Nick! <laughs> uh... There you go. French toast. Thank you. Ready for you. Maya, how are you? It's go it's good to see you again. <laughs> wow, I didn't think you'd really show up. That's not that big of a deal. You may have sound so far away, like so far away. Oh, well, maybe I exaggerated just a little. It was only two hours by train. If I had known you were this close, I would have visited more. No, you're not allowed. I already decided, you know. Until I become an adult, I have to work hard and be strong by myself. Oh. Well. Um. Anyway, congratulations. I'm glad to hear your training's going well for you. Looks like, looks like you're finally becoming a full-fledged medium, taking on your taking on your first job. Yeah, I didn't think I would be this soon. But this case, do you know the messy story behind it? <laughs> Behold the power of the Maya Intelligence Network. Let's see, 14 people dead because of malpractice on Dr. Gray's part, right? And to put the blame on the nurse, he killed her in what happened in what appeared to be a car accident. Huh? Um... So what is this Maya Intelligence Network? The tablet. <laughs> That's what I thought. I'm just playing your link, Nick. What really happened is the exact opposite. I heard all- I heard all about it from Dr. Gray. <laughs> oh, come on, Nick. I wouldn't take a cra- I wouldn't take a crazy killer as a client. Well, we don't know if he's not a crazy killer. He does some very untrustworthy faces. Technically, we're defending Maya. Oh. Okay. So he can still be the killer. Right. That's too scary, even for me. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Something happens to Maya. And I think she kills somebody. Oh, she's drugged, so. I wonder if this is what we made Von Karma.
game, but he is more so just kind of there. Yeah. Well, people liked Miles, so they didn't want him to be constantly losing. Or at least that's what the guy on the, uh, the interviewer said. What the guy said on the interview. A lot of people liked Miles. Especially with this whole arc and, um, turn about goodbyes. So this is your hometown, huh, Maya? Yep! Korean village. But I've heard people call this place Medium Valley, too. Interesting. So everyone that lives here is a spirit medium? Pretty much. Uh, most of my ancestors were, were too, I think. That's what your sense of the ability to communicate with the dead is so strong. Actually, only the women in the village are mediums. So what do the men do? They usually work someplace outside the village. <laughs> Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you about that girl I saw earlier. Do you know her? Oh, you mean Pearly? Pearly? Pearl Faye, she's my cousin. Isn't she adorable? Just like yours truly. Cousin. Like, does that mean she's also a... Uh... Yep, yeah, she's a medium too. Pearly's a real genius when it comes to channeling. Hmm, I see. I hope I didn't scare her off when I tried to talk to her earlier. Nah, it's not you. My aunt drilled, it, drilled, it, drilled it into her head that if a suspicious looking person tries to talk to you, run away. Suspicious looking? Well, you're not wearing training clothes, for starters. Of course not. Pearly is my aunt's most valued treasure, so she's not allowed to go outside of town. She doesn't know much about the world outside of Korean village. Aunt? Pearly's mother's my aunt, duh. Come on, Nick. Keep up. Well, like, well, like it's about to. It's, I've gotta go. It's, I've gotta get going. It's about time for the channel to start. Huh? Oh yeah. I'm doing the channeling in my house. So come on, okay? After I'm done, we can grill up some juicy burgers. All right. Good luck, Maya. Thanks. Some juicy burgers. Okay. Here we go. Well, at least she's the same as at least she's a that ah, English. At least she's the still the same Berkey Maya. <laughs> a giant rock it seems to be reaching the sky. Its origins are in an unbeaten up old sign. It looks like the giant rock is called Curian Boulder. There's a really complex explanation here. A long story short, it's a big stone for the spirits to live in. Or something like that. An old bus stop says Korean village on the side road. The buses seem incredibly this bus the buses seem incredibly inconvenient since they only come three times a day. The biggest, most elegant building is, uh, I can see from here. This is the Fame Manor, this is the place my calls home. It's easy to be overwhelmed by its presence. No clues there. Rustic batch roofed houses where other villagers live by the streets. They are nowhere near as large or as nice as the manor for me. It's kind of odd that I don't see any other villagers walking around though. Meditation room. Ooh. Turner Gray. Turning Gray. Mm. Living my guess. Turn her gray. Kill her. Maybe. No, no. Sorry. No, it's alright. Ah, uh, Mr. Wright, I'm glad you showed. So nice weather we're having today. Aren't you happy? No, not at all. That stupid weather girl made made the wrong call again. It will rain cats and dogs today, she said with a straight face. I can't believe they allow such misguided reports on public airwaves. Okay. 
Weather. Uh, reporting the weather is the only job you can get paid for getting it wrong. This is very true. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looks like talking about the weather for the, with the sky is just asking for punishment. Mm. But anyway, this is a splendid manner. No arguments there. It's hard to believe that this is my house house though. I was given a guide map of to this building. Here, Mr. Wright, I have a copy for you too. chat though I did just put links to like Twitter, Instagram, stuff like that, so make sure you follow those, especially the Discord. <laughs> that's worth learning more often than not. Well like a translation, once in a lifetime. A message is it's a message. It's messages people should value their ghostly meetings once as the once in a lifetime chance. assumption. He killed her. Okay. Maybe. Okay. Or she's gonna put it on him and then he's gonna do something and frame her. Fourteen patients died due to my negligence. And then on May 24th, I fell asleep at the wheel and died in a car accident due to my further ne negligence. I'm sorry and I apologize for being neg negligent. That's why I will have her right. See? I don't trust that face. <laughs> but a confession like that, the rain falling on my soul finally stopped. Oh, I see. How did you hear about my effect? I, I heard about her from an acquaintance, a girl studying uh, the occult at the college. Uh, the girl introduced me to this village. This is the home count, this is the hometown of the Curian School of Channeling. The home, huh? I 
name is Maya is the daughter of the master. The master? Huh. Anyway, the master's in the mighty slayer of the Uh, anyway, uh, do you see that door? That's the room where people in the stairs meet. Miss Maya's aunt is in there right now. Would you care to meet her? I'm doing my own thing here. Uh -huh. I'm gonna go. Wow, is really breathtaking. Someone put a lot of love into it. What's that over there? <clears throat> is that an incinerator? <laughs> Looks like a little out of place in a garden like this. Hmm. Looks like that's the that's a room over there too. A peaceful feeling is emanating from it. It's a really old urn. In the ashes of a person, long dead or inside. It looks like something with the history. Yeah, blah blah. blah. Okay. A splendid garden life with traditional decorations. So what's everyone's plans for the rest of the day? Me and Lance, we're gonna go out, but I don't know if we're gonna go out today. Considering, I think it's gonna rain. And it looks like it's gonna rain. Mm -hmm. Well, we're gonna go to Seaweed Rock, so I'm gonna bring my camera. Yeah, same lady. Mm -hmm. But I'm not gonna bring my camera out if it's gonna rain. Right. It's a small incinerator. I don't think a garbage truck comes all the way out here in the village in a tiny village like this. So every family has to burn their own trash. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna start with Maya's room. Hmm? I'm guessing this would be Maya's room. I don't know. Small alcove. Uh, no idea what it's supposed to mean or symbolize. <coughs> uh, I, uh, if I had one of these as an office, it would end up being storage space. But hey, it's decorated with some pretty flowers. Cool. Okay. okay. Probably be a nice to disturb or something. Who's sleeping then? Who's sleeping? A decorated wooden bear. That is- oh no, that is for other fish. <laughs> Kyrian village, the heart of channeling. <clears throat> what the? It's a souvenir. So does that mean it's easy to spot bears here? And for them to spot you? <laughs> This is the first time I've seen a sliding door like this in person. From what I hear, from what I, from here, I can see the winding way and a little garden in the courtyard. Okay. Are people sleeping, or is it a dead body? Who oh, no. knows? Could be both. Okay. Somehow I think we're going to be coming back here. Which doesn't make any sense because it's like, oh hey, you have five hours in a day but it takes two hours to get here. Well, again. Time is relative. <laughs> yes, I know, I know, details. Time is relative. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. June 19th, the Fame Manor, the channeling chamber. Okay. <laughs> I 
I will do that in a second. How many how many candles do you think they go through? Wow, it's there's such it's such a strange atmosphere. The flickering lights. I'm guessing they're candles. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> um, the hair is, uh, something. Uh -huh. Yeah. Thank you for the hydrate. Uh, good sir, who would you be? I'm sorry, uh, my name's Phoenix Wright. Oh, you must be that good sir. Good sir? Is she talking about me? Ah, you are a lawyer. Are you not good sir? I have heard much about you from Mrs. Maya. Is that so? Mrs. Maya. I am Mystic Maya's aunt, Morgan. Morgan Le Fay. <laughs> Uh, nice to meet you. Uh, I wanted to speak with you about a certain incident, good sir. It seems that perhaps you asked too much of Mystic Maya in performing your duties. Most unbecoming, I'm afraid. Huh? Don't tell me you have not. You have not already. You have already forgotten. Is that as if it's not for uh, Maya and her assistants, you would have sure you surely would not have been. It's called the I want to wear a hat, but I don't want to ruin my hair. <laughs> First the girl runs away, and now the old lady says, I stink for the job. Once did I become a poster boy for how not to make a first impression? <laughs> the past is the past, so let us not speak of the present now. Ah, thank you. The folding screen is really showing its age, all the engines are a bit tattered. The lettering is fading too, I think I don't know who, there was none though. Cool rock though. I'm pretty sure that's why. That's what it says. Maybe I'll ask Maya about it later. And this is where the medium sits, I assume. <clears throat> there are four panels of the story. The straw on the floor can feel a little damp, probably between the air. I guess this is an altar, whatever it is. It's very important. A mirror like objects with a cloudy reflection on the surface. Then some branches of a sacred tree have been placed in a predetermined arrangement. How does he know it's a sacred tree? Yeah. Would you please not touch this? Good sir, I would. I wonder if you would please not touch the sacred objects. Those objects are being offered to the spirits. If we were to touch them, good sir, they would become cursed. Yes, cursed. She really didn't have to talk down to me. I'm not that much of a kid.
So why why do you add Mystic to my to Maya's name? Isn't that a little strange? <laughs> I mean, it's not bad. I just don't know if I can finish it all. Oh, well, we've missed her off. Good, sir. Yes. How dare you be so rude and disre disrespectful for Mystic Maya? I'm sorry. She must be addressed by her proper title, good sir. You must call her Mystic Maya. Um, so about Mystic Maya. It is the blood. Excuse me? Blood? Mystic Maya carries the blood of the master. In, a in actuality, she's the only one remaining. <laughs> only one remaining, what's that supposed to be? Mystic Maya is the last of the rightful heirs of the Korean channeling technique. Okay, then, where do you stand? That's a little more complicated. Although the woman of the Fey clan, um, and I I am merely a member of the branch family. Branch family? What's that? It is as it sounds. I'm a, I'm a member of the fam of the branch family, no matter her spirit uh for a member of the branch family, no matter her spiritual power. She can never become the master of the Korean school. So how strong are you? It is a shame, however, I will admit I cannot even begin to compare my lowliness to the of my power to the masters. So that's how it is. It was her. She did it. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe. Well, she would have caused a dark Maya. She's her. She did it. She's jealous of Maya. So what's gonna happen to Pearl? So it's Maya's today's gonna be responsible for it. So today's channeling will be her channel will be her first. Yes, good sir. Because the spirit <laughs> of the person who dies of uh, the person who dies in the traffic accident traffic accident. It's usually very strong. It's usually easier to call that person to our world. Traffic accident. Huh? So I guess I should pull up Twitch now. Traffic accident indeed. The channeling will take place here. The cha uh, in this channeling cham chamber gets it. As you can see, I am in the process of preparing. So this room is the channeling chamber. A place- oh. <laughs> No, it's the bathroom. <laughs> a place- uh, The place where- The place where a spirit medium speak with, speak with- Speaks with those who have the heart. I don't suppose you, uh, you'd mind if I observed the session? You don't even think of such nonsense. Feeling, uh, only the medium and the client may enter here. Oh. Hi. Hello. So this is Morgan Fay. Morgan Le Fay. So is she like the aunt to Maya? Yes. 
But uh, Morgan Fay, Morgan Le Fay. That is Camelot. How do you not? Know, how do you not know who Morgan Le Fay is? I don't know. <laughs> how have you not seen like Merlin or heard of King Arthur or seen anything King? No, I actually haven't. But, uh, is it, what's the movie? Sorcerer's Apprentice? Yeah, we'll just show him that. This is a great movie. Oh, it is. It really is. What'd you, what'd you get for breakfast? Uh, some muffin pops. Some of those, uh, almond broken shapes. Okay. I didn't like the muffin tops. She's like, I wasn't half a fan of it when I tried one. It's like, it's like put it upside down, so that way it just kind of falls and spreads. Hmm. I just wasn't a fan of it. That's the one I tried a long time ago. That was a big. You. Ugh. Why are you using a plate? A, a, Glass plate. <laughs> Fair enough. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for following, Jack. Welcome to the Cryptid Council. I can English. I swear. Can you not? Because it's only it is your third language. It's not, it's not your original dialect. I I, I can English. <laughs> Sometimes she's not very well. This is true. The secrets of the Korean techniques can uh, cannot be seen by just anybody. I never stepped my eye from doing it in front of me before. <laughs> it is also for your safety, good sir. If something were to go wrong, that is why, while channeling, it's been informed that uh, the heavy door is a secure lock. Oh, you are nice! <laughs> so far, I don't trust the guy outside. I don't trust her. I mean, I don't like her either, but... I don't trust her. There's a guy outside. Oh, you're in the game. Yeah. <laughs> I can English, just not very well sometimes. It's not a lie. That's... Oh, that's what the log's for. Oh, yes. I wonder if you have yet to meet Pearl, good sir. Pearl! She's my adorable Angela Angelic. Not my. <laughs> you know what? Whatever. My work. She's my adorable and angelic young girl. It still works replacing Anne or mine. Oh, that just means you're VIP. <laughs> oh, did you go into moderator view? Yes. Okay, so now you see what I see? <laughs> A flipped coin will more than likely land on the side it started on. Okay. Oh, the music in these games are amazing. Yes, I agree with that. <laughs> I think my favorite... I think my favorite music is, um... Probably, like, uh, Mr. Badass's music. The Cowboy. Absolutely. <laughs> I like that music. <laughs> so we were doing the first try um no we were doing rise from the ashes and um i knew i knew it i knew that demon zant was had something to do with the case oh I'm absolutely how could you not i knew Look his <laughs> i knew his number was seven 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 five uh no, 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 <laughs> but it was the start of the trial we're walking around with emma and so we're doing the we're doing the start of the trial and um <laughs> and uh what is it um and i and the, you see the blue badger and i'm like what the hell is this thing and both of us are wondering 
And then I hear it, I'm like, I know what this is. I've heard this before, because uh, in... There's a YouTube channel called Random Encounters, Random Encounters, whatever it's called, and they did a Phoenix Wright musical. If you haven't seen it, I would highly recommend it, so check it out. But, <laughs> I, that's how I remember it. I was watching that, and I heard they had played this before Badger was in it. And so I'm like, I know the sound of that. I, where have I heard the sound? And then it's like, wait, it's the Blue Badger security camera! Oh, it's weird. They didn't use it as a security camera. I'm sure it will be used as a security camera. Oh, oh, and also, you're gonna you're gonna be voicing Doctor Hottie this time. Who? Okay. <laughs> wait, wait, who? <laughs> huh? No. no Am I being pulled into something that I don't want to be doing? Well, he's oh a God. Dude. He's a dude, so you have to voice him. Oh, is he as bad as Salmonella? <laughs> he hated Salmonella. Maybe. Maybe. I think he's just oh, weird. Great. Oh, wonderful. By the way, I'm Boyfriend Bigfoot. Nice yes. to meet you. Somebody redeemed the secrets of Boyfriend Bigfoot and you were in the comments to do the secrets of it. Oh, okay, uh, secrets. Uh, uh, the, the person's not here and we, we gave back his points. Oh, okay. Okay, so I don't have to do it right now. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes, this is my boyfriend. He, he does the voice of me. <laughs> she is my daughter. Now then, what was it you were about to say? Uh, what a cute daughter you have. Um... That's that. Oh. I believe that was my line. Now Fine, I'm read, read. Well, I'm sorry. You weren't here at ten to voice Phoenix for me. I told you I'd be here at eleven because I was getting breakfast. I know. Give me shit. Oh no, I know. But, um, what a cute daughter you have. <laughs> a pure heart knows not of the evils of this world is a powerful thing, good sir. <laughs> oh, what would you be, Dante? Oh, that's Dante. Oh, hi, Dante. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. My favorite character. Uh. <laughs> Me is cool. Uh. I'm probably partial and I love Miles. <laughs> I was gonna guess that, yeah, Miles would be I yours. like Miles, um, I Jake like- Jake Marshall for me. Mr. Badass. <laughs> Mr. I, Badass. I, I liked- I liked Will Powers. Too. He was funny. Fucking Will Powers, giant teddy bear. I put Miles in my favorite. <laughs> and he's not a dick. <laughs> he most definitely is. No, he's not. Mm -hmm. Please refrain from affiliating with her. I request. Well, it's not like I had the chance to anyway. Yeah, she could be the killer. Okay, so. Alright, so what have I missed so far in this trial? Uh. Turner Gray. That's the guy's name, Turner Gray. The guy who got killed? No, the guy who's outside. So he, he came to the office. And he says, you're coming with me, long story short, you're coming with me, and you're coming with me, so Maya will uh, channel uh, the spirit of this nurse who killed 14 patients out of malpractice. Jesus Christ. And she couldn't give a confession because she got into a car accident like a week later. Or like a day later, whatever it was. Wait, Maya? No, 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 the nurse. Oh, gotcha. At the start of the trial, though, we see Maya in jail. Again, because she got drugged and then she killed someone. You, you gotta stop going to those homeless people on the street and just taking their I, sugar. I was drugged. I, I, I think, I'm guessing she either drugged sugar. him or I'm guessing she drugged her. Because, you know, it's not sugar. You gotta take, stop taking that sugar from hobos on the street. No, but it looks good. Um, no, it's not sugar. Don't do it. It's trap. I must insist in stress that you not let it occur. Okay, okay, I get it. Sweet, who's her name? Pearl. This is, this is Turner Gray. Uh, I'm going with Turning Gray. <laughs> or Turn Her Gray. Like, turning to kill someone. I don't know. Okay. 
Uh, oh god, I'm gonna have to make a voice for you. Yeah. room is on the other side of this very heavy looking door. There's a giant iron lock where the handle is. It's like a curtain that separates the normal world from the spirit one. What? Turner Gray? Uh, Turner, Turner Gray? Turning Gray? <laughs> or Turner Gray like kill someone? <laughs> oh, oh, and last trial we met, we met Winston Payne again. I still all haven't the, seen Winston Payne. Yeah, well, all the names in this game are puns. Winston, Almost all of them. Oh. Winston Payne. Winston Payne. Uh, there was a lot of heart. A lot of heart. Will Powers. Will Power. Jack Hammer. That one's fairly obvious. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Red, white, and blue corp. True. Or as I call him, Captain Cork of Mega Cork. Um. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Damon Gann. So, as, as you call oh, them, again? demons and. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's a girl, so. Uh, well, uh, hey, you. <coughs> Christ almighty. Hey, you, hold on. This guy's got a few questions to ask. I'm sure I've oh, heard that uh, southern uh, accent uh, somewhere before. Oh, <laughs> Lord! <laughs> It's Lotta Heart! Speaking of Lotta Heart... Oh. Uh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. How do I do your voice? <laughs> it was a southern accent. No shit! I know it's a southern accent. Oh, well, uh, oh, well, that'll be. <laughs> it's Mr. Phoenix Wright. How you been? I haven't seen you in, what, a year? Um... <laughs> a lot of hair. Yes, a lot of hair. A lot of heart. We're a lot of heart, right? A lot of heart? <laughs> She's funny. Bingo! <laughs> the one and only paranormal paranormal photographer, a lot of heart. I was wondering who this college He kept going on about because Phoenix asked uh, uh, Gray, dude, hey, how do you know Maya? It's like, oh, I'm. Um, <laughs> but he was like, what? No, like, an acquaintance of mine uh, saw so you be a cult. I didn't even think it could be Lotta. Uh, that, well, that makes sense, actually. Yeah, it does! <laughs> ah, so I guess you're still a, or I guess you're still at it, being a photographer. Uh, of course! And today I'm gonna get a real life, uh, get myself a real life, real life scoop. You wait and see. Should you I? sure you can English? Oh, <laughs> my brain inje in injects words. Obviously. Injects words. Yes. But certain words that are not even right there in the sentence. Yes. Okay. This is why I can't read from a script. <laughs> I'll be like reading the script and I'll say something wrong or I'll add my own word or take one out. That's what you're like. Oh, that's right. This ain't no time to be wasting time. The channel's about to get started. You sound so down with that. I thought <laughs> she was more... Last time you voiced her, she was more upbeat and cheerful. One, I'm tired. Two, I can't remember her voice. It's literally an upbeat southern accent. Exactly! <laughs> <laughs> I thought she was a one-off character. <laughs> no, I would have thought. Yeah. <laughs> oh, didn't you hear he's coming back next case? <laughs> um, 
joking. I hope not. I don't know. I, that would be so uncomfortable to voice. Oh, God. Is it that time already? <clears throat> we all should hurry up and get to the meditation room. What are you waiting for? What are you waiting around here for? Come on. What a heart, huh? I couldn't. Okay. I'm sure they all lead to the same thing. I would have said, "Who are you again?" <laughs> <laughs> I would have put lot. I, I was like, oh, I did. I, I should have done a lot of hair. She does have a lot of hair. I've never seen a southern like woman like her with a red afro. Yeah, uh, she's one of a kind. <laughs> Apparently so. I've been judging her harshly because of that case. But I guess looking back. We had some good times, too. Yeah. Wait. So we're gonna go back to the meditation room? Oh, no. There's still a dead body in there. Okay. Oh! <laughs> that's what that is. I thought it was just someone sleeping. I think it is someone sleeping. <laughs> she, she said it could be a dead body. Examine. Kind of point. You might want to examine everything. I examined everything already. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess. Yeah. Well, this is the Fay Manor. Oh, wow. Okay. Is it scary to say with a southern <laughs> woman like that? <laughs> well, I. Uh... I mean, you know, you never know. We will now begin the channeling. Mystic Maya, an honored guest, please proceed with the channeling chamber. <laughs> Shit. Well, who's the doctor? Can I help? Sorry. Hmm? Oh, I was copying him. Oh. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, is that supposed to, is that supposed to be like the cocktail grenade? Yeah, the Molotov cocktail. It's... I know what it is. Yeah. Oh, God. What is his voice going to be? That's not very good. I was looking. <laughs> Are you going to work on the bat? Oh, there's Marvin. Oh, his name was Marvin? Yeah, remember? I named him Marvin the Dolph. Oh. Yeah, Marvin. This doesn't look good. Okay, well, uh, his name's Flipper. No, his name's Marvin. Marvin Flipper. 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 No, no, no. His first name's Marvin. <laughs> I couldn't Flipper the Dolph. <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> No, uh, I, I, I don't. I don't know what to do with that. <laughs> Straight up ambulance. Huh? Call the cleaning company. What is this going to be? Sometimes today would be wonderful. I know, I'm trying to figure out what this guy's voice would sound like. Well, let's, let's get let's see more of his faces. Uh, With this, I can finally spot all those pesky flies. Once <laughs> oh, he also goes on about the weather. How he hates the weather. Already. <laughs> okay. He hates the weather you hear me? They won't be able to say a single bad thing about me after this. <laughs> You would love to hear them apologize, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you, Mr. Wright? Me? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, I sure would. <laughs> Overconfident douche. <laughs> <laughs> Mystic Maya, do you have the uh, do you have the channeling chamber key? I was just oh, we walked in. Left 
faster. Happens for my dad. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, okay. Yep, right here. That is most satisfactory. That key is one of a kind, so please take care of it well. It'll be fine, Mom Morgan. I won't lose it, trust me. I was literally thinking Ida for My Hero Academia. Holy shit! Because he just kind of looks like Ida with him, like, pushing up his glasses and everything. And you wouldn't get it, you've never seen My Hero Academia. Who is Tenya Ida. He is one of the students of Class 1A. He literally has engines, or, like, more. His calves are huge, and he has, like, mufflers coming out of them. Oh. And he has super speed. Yes. Okay, Dr. Gray. Okay, Dr. Gray, let's get started. Finally. Let's go. <laughs> oh, well, that's not Ida's voice. Hi. Nick. Now let us be now let us wait patiently out here for them. Please have some please have some lovely bitter green tea and jaw dropping large strawberry desserts. Dude, I love My Hero Academia. It is my favorite anime. I'm still... Uh, oh god, I need to catch up on it. The last episode I saw was Lemillion. Where... Lemillion actually... Fought... Um, the leader of the... almost end up voicing. Hold on now, Granny. <laughs> granny? How can, we, how can we be allowed in that room? Dear Madam, you have an impressive grasp of English. <laughs> from where did you learn it? What? I'm from the heart of the heartland. <laughs> Is that so? I humbly request for you to return to this heart of the heartland. Wow, she's a bitch. Dabby? Dead. Is he part of the League of Villains? Oh shit, he is! I can see oh, it. Oh, that guy! I can see it. I can see it. Oh, he's a badass too. Even though he's part of the with League of Villains. With your voice and with your look, yes, I can see it. I, sh I showed him. Oh man, that's awesome. I can see it. <laughs> okay. He looks like he has the voice for him. Fair enough. This this is Cory and Bill. Oh. Her eyes. What the fuck? Lady, calm <laughs> down. Going into the Avatar state or some shit? Jesus. If you if you cannot follow our traditions and rules, we request that you leave. Sorry. She shot Lana up. Now that's impressive. And rude. She's not exactly like this. She doesn't want anyone talking to her daughter in song. She's trying to keep her right there. Who's her daughter? Pearl. Oh, you have no problem. No, yeah, no, no, he hasn't seen or heard you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I have not. Oh, no, but his, yeah, he, yeah, he could. I can see. <laughs> Fair now then, let us wait. Let us wait, okay. Uh. uh... 
Bang. Was that... that was a gun. I don't know. Hey now! What was that just now? It came from inside the channel chamber. Hey! That's a gunshot! I mean, Snapchat works. It's true. And voice. <laughs> Excuse me? I heard that sound before. It's a gunshot. I put my afro on it. Maya. Maya's in there. <laughs> Fuck it. Break into the chamber. Well, Mr. Lawyer, what's the plan? What else? We're gonna break in. Got it. We're going to have oh. We're going to have to break the door. Is that all right, Miss Faye? Well, yes, but there's one matter that is. Don't try to stop me. You can send the repair bill to the right and company law office later. Please hold. Yeah, that's what I call being a man. <laughs> The fact that it's an iron door. Oh, oh Dr. Gray is dead. Oh. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see it. What do you have on your... You know, I'm not even gonna ask. I think it's a filter. Is it? Uh, Might be. Not asking. Okay. Oh, you said that? Ugh. You said that? Oh, no. Dr. Gray! Both! You had, like, these weird things on your cheeks. <laughs> uh... Maya? What the fuck? I was murdered. Maya? That man murdered me. So I killed him! <laughs> so the ghost killed him! Great! Okay. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, you're acid. Because that's a normal thing. Wait, what? Uh, no. Okay. You know what? What? Sorry. <laughs> you weren't here? Lana, at a time like this? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Fine, read her a line. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, I'm not a southern woman. You think I am? <laughs> well, you're at least a woman. <laughs> Family's dead, man. <clears throat> Sounds like those are perfect for snapping up pictures. But anyway, what's going on in here? That gal, is she Maya? That might be. Yeah, that's her. Please leave this area to me. Go quickly and inform the police. But, but. Hurry before there are more victims here. Hey, let's go, Zinny boy. Leave, leave this to Granny. <laughs> doesn't get reception way out here. So I ended up using the phone booth to call the police. And? They're on their way. That's good. Lottie, um, I saw a genuine mysterious phenomenon. She seems really on edge because of all this. Not that I blame her. I'm scared to death by what's going on. <laughs> Hey, mister. That gal, Maya, she wasn't the one who pulled the trigger, was she? Oh, Jesus, she's got the blood. Oh, yeah. Maya doesn't know that when Maya's channel. Her whole physical appearance changes. Oh, shit. Hey, 
that again? Why are there only two of them in there? I reckon she must have done that then. You, yeah, you normal never. Uh, yeah, and this guy also, I think. What? Oh, I think it was my socks or something. No, we were talking about when we were playing Resident Evil. Besides 100 plus, but... <laughs> No, the socks, they're, they're, they're the swingers now, because they're not my partner, so... <laughs> yes, yes, that. Because I wear mismatched socks. And he hates it. But, you know. Wearing matching socks is boring. I, I can't stand having socks that don't match because they feel different, like one foot. Like, has a I don't know, just... The feeling of the socks has to be the same for each foot. Mario and Alice Angel. Mismatch socks or matching socks? Lada, what do you know about Dr. Gray? Not much, but I did some digging. That's one jet with a bad reputation. Really? Felix. He's good at surgery and stuff, but his personality stinks like a wet sheep. I'd say yeah with that. Oh, that doesn't bother me. Oh, I know it doesn't. Actually, I think all my socks are the same thickness anyway, so. The same Yeah. Because, you know, it'd be weird if you had, like, one sock that goes up to, like, here oh, on your shin. You. And then an ankle song. That would be just I don't I, I atrocity. It's dark time for me. <laughs> oh uh, no, I just gave her the idea. I hate those socks, so I wouldn't do it. Okay, good. At least you're not that crazy. Uh, maybe I'll wear me I'll maybe I'll wear different colored shoes. <laughs> I, I hate socks that go up to like, I hate like my socks. I, I like ankle socks. They're, they're not too high, but they're not too low. Yep. I used to only have socks that were up to like here. So I ended up just socks. More ankle socks ever since. Yes, old man's like. Socks, yeah. <laughs> I sort of got the same impression myself. He's real controlling. As soon as his nurse and his patient, uh, as soon as his nurse or patients don't do what he says, he starts to holler. Must have been a real rough to work with. She went off on him for not saying this thing. Yeah. It's rude. She has returned to this world. The spirit severing technique was successful. Let me see her, please. She is still unconscious. I humbly request that you wait outside for her recovery. Police are here. Sorry to keep you waiting. Huh? You again? Yes, me again. What are you doing all the way out here, Detective Gumshoe? It's actually kind of funny. I was in the area for a business trip. <laughs> <out. laughs> sure you were. Well, I like him too. It's a couple miles away. He's funny. He's funny. Well, time to check the crime scene. I'll have to question everyone here later on. So just sit tight, alright? I see you winning at me. What? Uh, are you supposed to say- <clears throat> Are you supposed to be saying me, dude? Or what are you trying to say? <laughs> Sorry. 
trailer show you the scene of the crime detective Jim Shoe. <laughs> June 19th, Fay Manor. Pretty sure there was someone sleeping here earlier. Like, how can I help you? Oh, Lord! Ah! Uh, I'm, uh, that is, I... Um, like, so isn't it about time to start? Huh? Time to start what? You know, like the spirit channeling. Channeling? Oh, 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 uh, no. Actually, the situation has kind of changed. Huh? Like, what do you mean? Please stay calm, but there has been a murder. Um, so, like, a murder is that thing where, like, one person kills another, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes, a person has killed another person. Oh, that's, um... What are the words I'm looking for? Uh, it's like, to it's like totally a bummer. Yeah. After all that effort, that's all she had to say? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to, like, introduce myself. My name is Eeny Meeny. Eeny Meeny? Meeny Meeny Miny Mo. Catch a tiger. Oh, Eeny Meeny. I thought that was just any, not me. Um, at the college I'm researching, uh, at the, at the college I'm researching and studying s Parapsychology. Parapsychology. Parapsychology? That's right. Um, I think people, like, usually call it occult studies or something. Like supernatural phenomena, ESP, and psychic powers, that sort of stuff. That's pretty out there. I'm Phoenix Wright, Ace. attorney at law. <laughs> so, what brings you here today? Um, like, so I was the one who told Dr. Gray about this place. Oh, never mind, I wasn't a lot of heart. Yeah. Was he asked me, like, do you know a good spirit medium? Say something about being introduced to this place. Because like talking to dead people, talking to dead people and like multiple personalities are my thing. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Then why were but she you was sleeping. Taking a nap here. She was Doesn't sleeping. Mean she was no. She was sleeping and there was only one and you can only open the door from the end. You can only really walk from the inside. <laughs> I regret that. Like, I wasn't feeling good. Huh? I'm like allergic to sesame seeds. Um, they like must have put something in the food that they the food they served for lunch. Oh, that doesn't sound fun. But okay, so first, if she's allergic, she would have gone into anaphylactic shock and she would have died without medical attention. Unless she had like an infant or something. True. Unless she's not that severely allergic. Well, there's allergic and then there's intolerant. Intolerance is when your body lacks the enzyme to break down certain food. So you just can't no, digest I know that. it. Yeah. Allergic? You can die. <laughs> You'll literally go into <laughs> anaphylaxis. And then just die if you don't get medical attention. Or have an epi pen. Well, we may have tried to kind of fall asleep. I don't know about that. <laughs> yeah, so, like, I felt sick and came here to, like, sleep. I totally feel like I've wasted my time because 
I like slept a long time. So like, can you like stop like talking like this like this like 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 no like why would I do that like are you kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> Not necessarily. That's allergic. That's severely allergic. Though, like I'm allergic to aloe, but <laughs> dying from out of contact. Mm. That's what I mean. Well, aloe is a topical thing. You don't ingest it. With food illnesses, there's intolerant and there's allergic. Allergic being the more severe one. like, you know, killed? The surgeon that requested oh, yeah. the channeling, Dr. Dre. Oh yeah, it was just dot dot dot. And then I asked her the next question. You and Dr. Dre knew each other, right? She's a killer. She did it. You're just contradicting yourself. It's her. She, she did it. Oh, drinks. Huh. Didn't she like Weird. literally just say she was there for Dr. Gray? Yes. Yeah, she did. Okay. Yeah. Okay. She did it. It's her. Hands down. 100%. But it, can also be it, can also be, it can also be Morgan Le Fay. Yeah, it could be. Could be set in the She could be set in my rope. Could be. I believe that's your line. The meat of it? No, I already read it. <laughs> oh. Oh, really? Then, what was all that talk about him earlier? Huh? Well, uh, like, a long, long time ago, I was, like, a patient. Yeah. She sounds like she's trying to hide something. Really? Mm -hmm. I used my deductive thinking skills to figure that out. Ever. Silent indeed. What's that she's got in her hand? I've seen it somewhere before. It's the key. Duck. Um. <laughs> what is it? Is it my hair? Is it too spiky? Not spiky enough? That was weird. That's Pearl. <laughs> That's Pearl. Alright. Cool. She's probably scared out of her wits after having a murder take place right by her. Lotta? Though. 
God don't let me. God me. don't let it be me next. Oh, okay. Thanks. Like that? Yeah. Don't scare me like that. What do you mean? You're the one. You're the one scaring me. If I, if I weren't so deaf, you'd be another dead body on, on your hand. There'd be a dead, another dead body on your hands. Mine. Okay. Wow. Jesus. Did you see or notice anything that stuck out to you? Now, well, only one thing. What is it? Turns out, of course, now it's not got a handle on this kind of thing. Huh? What? Curses and ghosts and stuff coming back to get you? Yeah. It's just a bit too much, I say. What is too much? Being a cool photographer. That's some, that's some scary stuff. And I think I'm gonna try being a celebrity photographer now. What is it? I took some odd pictures earlier. Huh? I remember I took some pictures. And the bird seemed inside. Oh, she did. Two, Two even. The seance murder. I'm sure it has an ice cream too. It'll be a sensational story. <laughs> hey, Ko. Thanks for lurking. How's your day going today? Wow. Sorry, just my journalistic sense of, is burning inside me. It's cut and run, but I'm heading back in. I gotta beat those cops and scoop this is for a century. Oh, no, okay, go. Oh. <laughs> oh, who's scarier? Lada or the spirits? I'm going with Lada. Actually, no, Von Karma. Von Karma or Justin? <laughs> yes. Sweet Jesus, yes. And her broken eyes, he's scary from the side. But he's even scarier from the front. And when he opens his eyes. <laughs> oh, then you got hell's frozen over. Why does it feel like we've been through this before? She gave you the key to the channeling chamber, mm -hmm. didn't she? Pearl? Well, then we can go to the channel channeling chamber. Well, she gave you the key. No, she was holding the key. Police are busily running here and there. I don't see Maya anywhere. But hey, you, don't touch anything. No, look, I really anything. need to ask you some questions. Um, don't look at me like I'm some sort of uncaring jerk. Tell you what, pal. I'll let you ask me a few questions, alright? Hey, pal. No touching without my permission. I'm not touching, I'm looking around. I'm just looking at it. Hey, you can't be so careful. A kid like her can be a murder suspect, can I? It's hard to search this room. Peter. I guess we just have to talk to him for now. Yeah. Wait, 
and Scarecrow's a guy. Sorry, you guys, uh... Because you can't press that. You're, you're talking mostly. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, Jesus. You were shot in the forehead. Oh! Hey. hey. What? 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 He was also stabbed in the chest with a knife. A knife? Basically, the victim was first stabbed, then he was shot. Huh. Huh. But there were two gunshots. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What? We heard two gunshots, though. Wait! Wait, what? Wait, what? Never mind. Never mind. Angel alums a guy. I saw Angel, I fuck girl. Anyways, Scarecrow's gonna be in season three of Titans. Archway. I know, that's what I said. Which archway? What? Oh. Oh, dear madam, you have such impeccable timing. Like, what's all the buzz? <clears throat> Alright, everyone. Listen up. You too, pal. I'm gonna give you all a brief update. Right now, it looks like the investigation's not gonna be done until real late. That is a terrible shame. Because I want to go back to my soap operas. I promise that everyone sleep under the roof of the Fay Manor tonight. Because that's that such a good way. idea. A mess. I can't believe how crazy this day turned out. Maya was arrested again and taken away by the police. I don't see myself getting any sleep tonight. Dun, 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 dun. So at least we're looking around and collecting all that evidence before we have to go to trial. Yep. Perfect timing because I haven't actually yawned. Huh. Ugh. Warning. I guess it must have nodded well, what, off at some point. What archway is it? I don't know what archway you're talking about. Uh, uh, is it like in a map or is it... Okay, Dante, thanks for hanging out. <laughs> See you, Dante. I hope Maya's okay. I should hurry and get to the detention center ASAP. Okay. You didn't want the text to go through? Nick, mm. <laughs> Nick, Nick. I. Maya. What am I going to do? I never imagined it would turn out like this. Calm down, Maya. Take deep breaths. I think of it. The first time I met her, it all started right here in this detention <laughs> center. Of course it did. Oh, yeah, you didn't do that case. No, I didn't. Oh. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, because she was Technically, the killing the system. Yeah. Oh. But then it... Turns out it was red, white, and blue corp, right? Yeah. Yeah, no, I I, I saw the name uh, Angel uh, Angel alum, and I'm like, oh god, they're making Scarecrow female. And I looked him up, I'm like, oh, okay, it's a dude. Okay, crisis averted. <laughs> <laughs> crisis averted? It's on the map with the multiple... It's on the map with multiple maps. The Coliseum... Is she talking about, is it in, no, is it the one where you go, is it the... Oh, Time Park?
Because if it's... Oh, wait. Or, or is it... No, it's the other one, I think. It's, it's up on the archway. You need the, uh, the soldier with the... Or a pea shooter. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think, okay, I think I know what you're talking about. So, you want a pea shooter or a soldier, and you want to jump on, um, like the, there's like a, th uh, there's like a, like a, it's a ledge, and then you jump into the fire. Hey, galaxy. It, I would, I would be, I would be pissed off for a different reason, but that's a not stream comic. Um, so yeah, you jump on this, like, ledge, and then you jump on the fire, and then you have to just kind of, like, jump up top. It, it takes time. Unless it's talking about the other one. I don't know. The other one with the multiple with the multiple portals, you have to catch the point. I've tried that. It, it, all you can do is try. You just have to jump up and grab it. That's a hard gnome to get. Yeah. Like, you... That's the only way you yeah, can get you, it. Yeah, you need a jumping thing. And I think you have to do the soldier. Try the, uh, try the soldier. Try the soldier. Um, or pea shooter. You have to try the, or... It's, it's a hard one to do. It's... But change, you gotta change your pea shooter settings. Oh, I so. the high jump. I don't know if she has that. I think it either goes forward or... It, Jumps forward or jumps high. I think. I'm pretty good though, Galaxy. How are you? Oh, excuse me. I think. <laughs> a dolphin shouted out Galaxy and Galaxy <laughs> shouted out Dolphin. <laughs> <laughs> and make sure you check out both wonderful streamers. Uh, they both do a lot of variety of games and Galaxy Game Hot. <laughs> Oh, I'm supposed to show everyone my impressions and stuff now that yes. Galaxy's here, no. right? It should just make, it should just make, um... Well, I mean, this is the perfect game to do, so... Yeah, just make Phoenix sound like he's, like, a down jack of all voices. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fair enough. I finally, I finally get to see you again, and... It's not your fault. You didn't do it. Face palm? Why are you doing a face palm? No, I I did it. I killed that person. But that wasn't you. Doesn't matter. It might as well have been me. I was too weak and I, I couldn't control the spirit's power, so I don't want to bring up the case quite yet, but we have things to talk about. I mean, oh, the secrets of everyone. Oh, jeez. Ah, uh, secret. Uh, I mean, he can... Yeah, we, we can give you the points back, or he can just do it today. I think he did in the comments. What? Oh. Uh, Dolphin. Oh. You don't have to be nice to me, Nick. I understand. What's your secret? I can't believe that you like that you don't like cake. I already know that one. Another food one. I actually don't like any vegetables except for corn on the cob, and it oh. has to be on the cob and has to have butter on it when you eat it. That's the only vegetable I would eat. Although you don't it's like technically not a vegetable, it's a starch. You don't like corn with frozen bag corn? I know, I'm weird. Corn on the cob, cut it. Frozen back corn is corn it, on the cob. D d d don't. I'm just saying. D d the secrets of Bigfoot and the secrets of baby Bigfoot. And, and the boy from Bigfoot. Yeah. I just told mine. <laughs> no, she had redeemed the things yesterday. Yes. So that one was they have to reveal a new secret. Uh, you guys go first while I get another one. <laughs> well, no, it's not, it's not uh, so easy, is it? <laughs> yes. Oh. Uh, yeah. I hate the beach. You hate the beach? Huh? Yeah, I grew up, well, so during the summer when my grandparents, I lived in Biddeford in the Hills Beach area. And so, 
I, you know, I would spend the summers with them every day, and we'd go to the beach every day when I was younger, it was fine, but as I grew older, it had the opposite effect of me, where I didn't want to live on the beach, I really, I grew to quite hate the beach. <laughs> and I would only go when it's high tide, I loved it when I was older, and I was able to leave, like, can I go home now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, I hated the beach, though, it was just... Then that, then that happened like, way too truly. I went, I went when it was high tide. I love sharks. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a secret thing. Okay. Well, that's, uh, that's, that's all secret. Some people may not know that about me. I do. I love sharks. I think they're like the coolest things in the world, the coolest animals, and they're just amazing. And they're, you know. So when you make a shark stuffed animal, you're, uh, that's going to be in your room? I know Carol was like her uh one of her grandsons like sharks. <laughs> cool. Like how grandma used to say I know she used to do it with little girl. There's no sharks in our ocean. I'm going bullshit. It's an ocean. <laughs> Where there's ocean there's sharks. She goes, well they're not here in this area. I'm like this. <laughs> Just because you don't see them doesn't mean they're not there. Foster check. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, uh, what's your, uh... I'm just trying to think of something. Um... Oh, I put... oh uh, in, with doing certain things, I guess, I'm a righty, but with certain things, I guess I'm a lefty. Like, when I open bottles... Righties usually open it with their right hands normally. I open it with my left hand. And I'm ambidextrous when it comes to mopping and sweeping. So, I don't know, that's all I can think of. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. Well, if we haven't started today. Sweep or hold it like that and sweep. Or, yeah. You've died, right? <laughs> Couple times. <laughs> uh, favorite what? Yes. So, like, favorite DC character, favorite favorite Marvel character, <laughs> something like that, or like favorite book or whatever, music genre, etc. <laughs> All right. Phoenix. <laughs> yes, she is. <laughs> oh, the voices. Oh, yeah, I can do a stretch. Hey, Phoenix. I can do a stretch. You have to read. <laughs> you can stretch and read at the same time. <laughs> so, you're the master or something of the Korean school channeling? Actually, my mother is, for now. This is. Oh, so our mother's back? I thought their mother died, right? She, she ran off. Oh no, it's her sister that died. No, duh. But since the title's passed down from mother to daughter, I guess I will be sorry. But many people think that the channeling isn't real, that it's all just a You believe in us, don't you? Yeah, because I've seen it with my own eyes. Why is channeling a spirit? But her whole physical appearance changes. <laughs> yes, but Dolphin, uh, favorite, uh, what? What would you like to know our favorite yeah. something of? <coughs> oh, <laughs> it's a supernatural phenomenon that. Every time. A lovely image. Mm. It happened this time, too. Dr. Grace said that he wanted to call the nurse, so. <coughs> Who is you? I don't 
know if I can answer that. Favorite viewer? Well, technically, it's not my channel, so. Yeah, sorry, I'm not answering that question. Pick something else. <laughs> <laughs> I love you all equally. We'll go with that. Thank <laughs> you. Oh yeah, this is a different game, different cases. <laughs> okay. We love all our fans. Yes, we do. Yeah, we finished the first game. This is the second game. Second we game, yes. How many games are there? A shit ton. We were only playing three. This is the second game. How long is this game gonna take us? Especially with the last fucking trial. Like, Jesus Christ, that that last one on the last game took forever. I think the fourth case is like that. Yeah, the fourth case is like that, yeah. So, okay, so what you're telling me is that we have two cases. That are gonna be like that in this game. Probably because there's probably gonna be a fifth bonus case like last time. Wonderful. Great. Mm. Um, your favorite Marvel character in Y Lens. My favorite Marvel character is Wolverine. Do I need to answer this question too, or is it just for him? Um, this is gonna take 10 years, and then the next one's gonna take 15 years. Oh, sweet Jesus. But, um, the reason why Wolverine is my favorite Marvel character is because when I was a kid, I got, like, this action figure of him, and I just thought his claws and stuff were so cool. Then I got to researching him more as I got older and found out his actual power is the healing factor. I found out like his backstory and how he lost his memory and everything. And I honestly just like Well technically all of us, because my mom is also included. Oh, and I and I did change a reward. I'll do that afterwards. Oh, okay. But um he just always really fascinated me. So Wolverine is hands down my favorite not only Marvel superhero, but my favorite superhero of all time. Comfortable? No. Okay. Sorry, I'll go. <laughs> Sorry. I was kind of digging into my shoulder. Uh, my favorite Marvel. I'm SAG. Yes, Wolverine's not a her. Wolverine's a him. I'm half asleep. I'm gonna... <laughs> oh yeah, was that uh, question the uh, the favorite blank for me, or was it for everybody? Yeah. I'm sag. I don't know what I'm sag means. Oh no, I think um, Dolphin misread this, and she's like, oh no, I'm a she, I don't like Oh, her. oh, okay, yeah. yeah, no, no, yeah, no, sorry. But Galaxy, I think, was asking, was the question <laughs> for me. Yeah, no, Dolphin, it was like, is the question for all of us, or just Lance? Yeah, like Galaxy said, he's still half asleep, so he's doing some typos and whatnot. But yes, Wol Wolverine is not a she. Although he has a daughter, though. Yes. He has the same powers. Oh, okay. So, Galaxy, I guess you're also that picking too. this or that as well. I believe that's what she said. But also, Wolverine... Alright, have uh, fun, in the Dolphin. Comics, Come back soon. In the comics, Wolverine also has a son. Yes, he has quite a few children. Yeah, I don't think he would be the superheroes. Uh, I... The X-Men? I, I mean, 
in all real reality, I mean, the, the, the Avengers, and when I say Avengers, I'm talking about the ones that were in the movie, mm-hmm. are like all of my favorite ones. And yep. I know that there's no Marvel, you know, I didn't care for Captain Marvel, but I love Tony Stark's Iron Man. Iron I Man was awesome. He just, and I mean, I don't know anything about Iron Man other than what you saw in the movie. Exactly. Yeah. And I love Thor. Again, I, in the movies. Because I don't care how bad the movie was, it was just fun to watch him. <laughs> oh, so a funny thing about Thor. He was Thor. just fun to look at, sorry. <laughs> He's hot. Funny thing about Thor, when I was still going to therapy with my first therapist, her and I were talking about the Marvel movies, and she's like, I think Thor's really hot, the guy who plays Thor. Yeah. And, she, and, and I had already seen Endgame, and I'm like, oh, okay, well, you might have a different view about him once you see him in Endgame. She's like, nah, I don't think so. And I'm like, okay, imagine Thor is the plot. The plot thickens. <laughs> then I, she saw it, she's like, I, I I didn't care. I'm like, oh, okay. I, I, did, I, I don't like the X-Men. I don't like I mean, the movie X-Men was good. I was like, I, I, I mean, I, I liked what they did. I liked X-Men. I liked... I didn't like The it. whole new thing. I liked the whole characters that they came up with. And I mean... He does. Again, I, but I don't... I, I'm not a follower of X-Men. But um, I guess uh, there's a theory that when Hulk snapped. Spoilers. Spoiler, spoiler, spoiler. Okay, the movie came out two years ago. Still, people might not have seen it yet. Two years ago! Still. Still. Two years ago, dude! Still, there's people out there who might not have seen it. But anyway, spoilers again. Two years ago. When, okay. <laughs> when Hulk um, had the gauntlet and he snapped, there's a theory that since they saw that nothing really happened, they speculate that he might have created the mutants with that snap. And that could introduce, like, the X-Men and everything in the Marvel Cinematic oh. Universe now. Cool. I'm, I don't, it's, it's I don't just, think... It's just a theory. I don't know if we're going to be watching Loki. Because he isn't, like, a mutant. See? Galaxy Gears is me. Two years ago. I have a point. Yeah, but you still don't know if people might have seen it or not. People are on the internet. They like Marvel. You know, it it shows you scenes. Oh, like, if you look... Like, the one... Like, you look up something from Avengers, and you say, oh, hey, here's a scene for Endgame, because you like Avengers. I mean, I still like the scene when it had... Uh, the White Walker and Thanos have to take that by a start or something. Me too! <laughs> Me too! <laughs> you know you just spoiled it for him, right? I'm sorry. <laughs> well, I don't know which start. <laughs> Valid point. Because you know the White Walker is going down. That's not oh, yeah. you know. <laughs> That's funny. I guess the theory is that the when Hulk snapped his fingers, he created mutants. Yes, because when Hulk snapped in the movie, also, hey, nothing Phoenix, Phoenix, really happened. Oh, no, I know. But, uh, when Hulk snapped, nothing really happened in the movie. So, they there's a theory, again, it's just a theory, that he created mutants with that snap. But, yeah. Just a theory, like I said. A game theory? Not a game theory, movie theory, I'm sorry. Do you know who Mad Pat is? No. It's <laughs> Alright, anyway. Um, Maya's body must have taken on that nurse's appearance. Uh, I, don't know. I don't know if I'll be watching Loki with how... Joy, Ironheart. Ironheart. I looked into her backstory and it it, it looks so bad. Is that gonna be his daughter? No, 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 
new one. Oh. Yeah, she's the 14 year old from MIT, right? Yes, that has the same backstory as Tony Stark. <laughs> I never even heard about her. That's Ironheart, Riri Williams. Okay. I... I have no issue with her. It's just, I wish they made her backstory different. Because her backstory is legit a carbon copy of Tony Stark. She got bored, she made the suit, and then she took it for a test drive, and then um, I think she crashed and she had to get like a glowing heart like Tony had. Yeah, that's basically the exact same thing. Hey, I'm sorry, it's the stupidest backstory unless they change it. It's the worst backstory in the world. Because <laughs> it's a carbon copy of Tony Stark. Okay, not to, to uh, break off subject here, but did you, did you watch the episode in the Fox Disney Iron Man? No. No, I didn't. Oh, it was awesome. They made the Iron Man suit? Oh, yeah. wait, no, did I? Oh, maybe I did, actually. That's so cool. And they actually got it to fly. <laughs> oh, my God, that's awesome. Yeah, I, th oh, I think I saw it, actually. I remember it's awesome. That's <laughs> so cool. Oh, my God. Yep. <laughs> I never knew about that. Yep. Her backstory oh, is just, I, I, don't I don't like her. I don't like her backstory. I love her. So. <laughs> yeah, it's sad that the show got canceled. No. no. It's not canceled. I thought it did. Yeah, it because, yeah um, it's canceled because um, Jamie, Jamie and Adam are the guys' names, right? Yeah. Well, no, they did, they did like a whole series to find two new Mythbusters for the show. Yeah, well, apparently it didn't work out well. Yeah, <laughs> but I guess they were getting tired of working with one another. What's his face just died though? Oh yeah, Grant and Mahara. Grant, yeah. I was like, oh, is, is, how, how? He had some sort of cancer, I think. Pretty sure. I hope so. I really, but no, she's like five, unless they like, unless they speed up unless her they aging. Fast forward. But that would that, that would fast forward everything else. Mm -hmm. I I'd be fine with it if it was her daughter, if it was his daughter. I just I don't agree. With it. I, her back was just so stupid. And I know there's a couple scenes in the comic where I think. I'll tell you about it after. It's not a daughter. No, no, I'll, I'll tell you about it afterwards. Because I, I have seen, like, scenes of, like, I've seen some of the panels. But, I'm not thrilled with her. What exactly happened in the Chandler Chamber? I don't know yet. I went to the room with Dr. Gray, locked the door, and sat down across from him. Okay. We closed our eyes and I began to chant. This is sounding kind of creepy. The beginning of a scary story. And that's the last thing I remember. What? After a spirit comes into, come, comes into my body, I lose myself. Slow down with speaking so you don't <laughs> mess, mess up. You know my brain's gonna interrupt for a few minutes. Fine. But after a spirit comes into my body, I lose myself. And I are you happy? Better. There you go. English. 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 You know what? Whatever. <laughs> then you don't remember a single thing? When I came to, I was being held by my aunt in my aunt's arms. And there was blood all over my clothes. Hmm. Oh, but I do remember having a dream. A dream? Just a dream. What kind of dream did you have while you were channeling? Um, I can't remember it all that well, but I was dead and buried in the ground. I couldn't move, and I was un and it was unbearable, really suffocating. It went something like that. I, I see. I have no idea what to say to that. And then there was a really familiar smell too. Yeah, I get it. Chini is an Avenger. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I, I don't like her. <laughs> I just think we've done so much more with her in the backstory. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. That's basically just a copy of And that's what I think when it first came out, that was her backstory. They could have changed it since then. So I don't follow her because I don't think her as a character. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, so it's not gonna be his daughter. Actually, what is his daughter's name? Oh, I forget. Oh, it wasn't Morgan? Yes! <laughs> oh man, but when... <laughs> in the end game, when they were like, after Tony's funeral and stuff, and Happy was talking to her, and he was like, you want some meat? She said, a cheeseburger. I was like... <laughs> Because remember the first Iron Man movie where he's like, he gets back from being captured and it's like, I want a cheeseburger. I haven't seen the first Iron Man movie in a long time. No, but well, it was a reference to the first Iron Man movie and I just about teared up. I was like, Oh, it was crying. Oh, Damn, I, my I was heart. Like, I was crying through that rough Iron Man movie. Endgame? I was crying through Infinity War. <laughs> Loki died in the beginning of it. Oh, that's true. Then everyone that's gets true. dusted. That's true. Yeah, I'll be like, holy shit. That's true. Falcon, Bucky, two of my favorite characters, gone. Black Panther, my favorite character in that movie. Eh, his didn't bother me. Spider-Man Spider kind of got me, though. Yeah. Honestly, well, just, Black Panther's so fucking awesome. He's okay. I love Black Panther, too. Yeah, I knew she was getting a show. <laughs> I don't like her either, but I think I don't like her character. <laughs> I think her character's boring. <laughs> Kamala Khan. I I don't like most Marvel characters. <laughs> oh, I know this. Yeah, I don't like I didn't like Kamala Khan. And no, in the I know he's not dead, but in the beginning of it, in Infinity War, he died. So, well, <laughs> so that Loki's dead. The Loki that is alive is the one that was from Avengers. No, no, no. It's one from a different timeline. Yeah, no. Loki's still alive. Loki's alive. It's just not the same Loki that was with Thor. Like Thor and Loki on the spaceship with, um, uh, big purple space dildo. That's not even my nickname for him. Anyways, <laughs> Thanos. But the, the Loki that's alive oh was from the, the Avengers movie when they were arrested. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I can't quite place it, but I know I smelled that same sound before. This is about all the information I'm gonna gather for today. I'll be back later, Maya. Ooh, excuse me. In the meantime, please make sure you prepare it, okay? Huh? It? What is it? <laughs> Don't you like my nickname for him? Well, <laughs> that big giant purple space dildo beat the shit out of Hulk. I know Thanos was strong, because he didn't even use the power. Yeah. He didn't use anything to beat the shit out of Hulk. Just his pure brute strength. I just... I didn't realize he was taller and bigger than the Hulk, too. That was interesting. <laughs> oh, well. nothing else shut up now. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I liked... Thanos? Mm. Josh Brolin did a really good job playing him. He did, and the thing is, he really did. He wasn't. You know what it was about him? He everybody like everybody looks at him as like evil, and he really wasn't evil. Oh no, his ideals, when you think about it, <laughs> really wasn't. No, and he he didn't, was trying to do it for a greater happy yes. purpose. But he, but if you watched but. him, he really wasn't happy about. Mm -hmm taking half of the world, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. it, it, like, it weighed on him. And, it did. And he, you could tell that. And that was an interesting aspect about a so-called villain. Do you know oh, what yeah, I mean? Oh, yeah, I know. It wasn't, like, your typical evil versus good type thing, you know? Yeah. I mean, granted, it wasn't the thing to do, but it wasn't like he was... It wasn't self-serving purpose. Yeah. It, you know, it was like... He was trying to preserve, basically, life. the universe. Or yeah. Something. I think he's one of Marvel's but, better villains. Yeah. Right. But he wasn't your typical evil... Oh, like, no, I know that. He wasn't doing it to say, hey, we're just going to kill off the world. And, yeah. you know, and, and if you watched, <laughs> like, like I said, if you listened to his whole, the mannerisms and his looks, and it 
mm-hmm. really weighed upon what he was doing. It weighed upon him. Yeah, like he said, he wa- he just wanted balance, really. Right, exactly. Yeah. And it, it well, was an interesting... Your turn. It no, was no. interesting. Because, and you could tell just by the way he, wa- he was. Thanos. I mean, yeah, the big purple space dildo. <laughs> purple dildo, for sure. <laughs> no, he, I think he is one of... Than, I think he's one of Marvel's better villains. Oh, like, absolutely. Most of their villains are kind of bad. <laughs> Some of them are. Most. No, did not say all. Oh, most. Because I think I think like one of the things a lot of people say, which I I don't agree with personally, but Marvel has better heroes and DC has better villains. I don't agree with that personally because I I like a bunch of the DC heroes, but I can kind of see what they mean because like a lot of like DC's villains are very complex and they're very. Um, you know, like Joker is just doing things for the fun of it and no one understands them. Yep. But then you have well, the Joker's just fucked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But then you yeah. have he's villains. just fucking crazy. But then you have, like, mi- villains like Mr. Freeze, that he's not a villain because he wants power or money. He is right. a villain because he's just trying to save his wife. <laughs> exactly. He, he, he wasn't another one. He wasn't just out there to. He was the trying to save and, his wife and right. he was also going to get revenge on the guy that he. Was his name? Um, getting on the guy that turned him into Mr. Freeze. Yeah, I can see. You know, yeah. I can see that. If I, yeah, I think, but I think Thanos is one of Marvel's better villains. Because I know, like Ronan's yes. not Ronan's not really a good villain, and then you have Ego, and Ego's just Ego's also mm, a yeah. dick. Yeah, he's just a dick. Whenever the song Brandy, You're a Fine Girl comes on, I'm always like, hey, look, it's Star Lord's Dickhead's dad song. <laughs> yes. I have to admit, though, Yondu. I love Yondu. Oh, I love you. Oh, my God. I'm Mary Poppins, y'all. <laughs> Mr. Freeze. Why did you turn him over to his father? He goes, why? Well, I was going to turn him over to that asshole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Because I think he ate his kids. Uh, ego. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he basically, like, absorbed their energy. That's what all the bones and stuff were. Oh, no, I know that. Yeah. yeah. He was trying to find, like, the perfect kid for them to take over his place or something. And if they didn't have his powers or something like that, he'd just kill them. I don't know. Yeah, yeah and even Man Bat. Um... <laughs> Man Bat? Let me guess. Wayne Bruce? No, no his name was Kirk Langstrom. <laughs> It would have been so much funnier if it was Wayne Bruce. Well, no, he was a dog. He was a scientist slash doctor, and he was trying to find the cure for deafness. And um, he mm-hmm. was doing genes with um with bats. Uh, oh, with but, echolocation. And yeah, stuff? I think so. But he, uh, something went wrong, and it turned him into this giant bat. Um, and but he ended up killing his wife. He's really okay. cool. Man, bat's really cool too. I love man bat. Bruce, man, bat. His name is Kirk Langstrom. Not all capes wear heroes. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that would that would have been funny though if his name. Sci- was yeah, actually... okay, scientist. I couldn't remember if he was a scientist or a doctor. But he was trying to find the cure for like deafness because he was going deaf himself, and then he killed his wife. Actually, in Arc of Night, they. If you travel back to uh, October thir- October 31st, 2014, I think, if you go to the jail cell, if you're, obviously, you've freed Man Bat, or you've, um, you turned him back into a human, um, it will show Man Bat escaped. But, if you go to his lab, I think it, it references the fact that, uh, Mrs. Man Bat might be out, or out and about. <laughs> okay. Hey, Zach, what's going on? They had, I'm sorry, they could have had such a great opportunity. Man, Bat, Wayne, Bruce. I think that would have been hilarious. Sure. Um, yeah. <sighs> oh yeah, all the actors, they have from Marvel play them very well. Oh yeah. <laughs> he does. Um, I know my mom, so my mom and I are playing, well after this we'll have to get back to the game. So my mom was playing Arkham Knight, and she made me do Joker in the beginning of the game. 
And I jumped because I wasn't expecting him. You know, you're moving these giant tubes, and if you move too quickly, you're going to die. Um, so you're putting the tubes in, putting the tubes in. And after you put the second one in... Well, it's almost the last one. The almost last one. A lot, Okay, so like the fourth one. Joker pops out. I jump like 50 feet in the air because it's like, Jesus Christ, dude, you burned in the beginning of the game. <laughs> and... It was great. It was great. <laughs> oh, man, She's playing funny. it. And uh, she's just flying around Gotham City doing her own thing. The man bat jumps out and scares the shit out of her. <laughs> wasn't expecting that out. But the Joker one was great. Because that one didn't scare me at all, but I'm like, I've got to get Jason. <laughs> I'm in easy mode. And it's right at the beginning of the game. So I'm like, just play it. Just, you've got to play through the game. <laughs> and what? she's playing it and playing it and playing it. She's putting the tubes in, and she turns around, and Joker is right there, and she's like, "What the Christ!" <laughs> <laughs> and she must have uh, jumped. I mean, oh my god, it was the funniest thing. I'm like, that's all you need. <laughs> <laughs> that's like awesome. I said, you see Joker's body and burn at the beginning of the movie, so yeah. That's the last thing you're expecting. <laughs> and then from then on in, you have the conversations in your head with Joker. Okay. Well, okay. Context. So the whole reason you're moving tubes is because um, Joker, or Scarecrow is now wreaking havoc. Scarecrow is in charge and yeah. he's trying to plunge those whole all of Gotham City in fear. Yeah. Oh, part. nice! How's it turning out? But anyway, so he's trying to plunge Gotham City into the biggest thing of fear. And so he, uh, Scarecrow has a, a fear bomb go, that's going to go off, and Batman's like, okay, well, if I do this, um, I can uh, like lower the radius so not as many people get affected. He would die in the process, of course, but he's trying to save Gotham City. So, and that's why he's seeing things, because it's because the fear is it's it's also a mix of the fear and the Joker to toxin that's in him. Okay. Or not Joker, a uh, Titan. But Titan still is still kind of in him, even though he took the cure in Arkham City, but in fear toxin. So it's, it's a mix of that. Okay. But there is actually a theory that Batman, again, just a theory, uh, <laughs> that Batman is um, in a mental asylum and he's imagining everything that's going on and Joker's like the doctor Harley Quinn is like the nurse therapist like or psychiatrist in, or something because that's what Harley Quinn is that's what she was before Joker I love <laughs> you gotta... but th there was like a theory that like he's actually in the asylum and he's insane and yeah yeah that's <laughs> one night <laughs> um, I, I know in Arkham Origins, it's all one night because the um, a group of as uh, assassins are like, "Hey, let's just do this." Let's, let's we, we, we're like, "Oh no, it's it's Joker disguised as Black Mask and Black and Joker as Black Mask puts out this hit on Batman." So you have Shiva Copperhead, who was a bitch to kill. Oh yeah, sorry, Alf. Uh, so you have Sashiva, Copperhead, Copperhead, Killer Croc, Garfield Lins, a.k.a. Firefly. Oh, yes. Deathstroke, he was a pain in the ass, too. Uh, and a couple other people. Uh, I can't think of their names. Oh, Deadshot. Deadshot, yeah. And there's two other ones. Oh, the Electrocutioner and somebody else. But, anyways, they're all out there to get Batman and get the reward. Well, okay. the Electrocutioner was just there at the beginning of Arkham Origins. We didn't even touch him! Yeah, I know. He fell out. Well, Joker comes to Mount Hotel. <laughs> yeah, no, it takes like it feels like it's so much longer. It's like, oh, this all happens in one night. Yeah. Arkham City happens in one night. Yeah. No. Yeah. 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 Actually, technically, like ten hours. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, ten hours. He's going all. He's going halfway across Gotham City, left and right, or Arkham City. Sorry, it's still part of Gotham. You know, he, 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 did I do everything in? Did I did I get it? Did I finish? The, Bane, yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Did I finish? Nice, nice. What kind of cure are you I making, um, Dalton? I think I did that to one hundred percent. Hmm. I think I did Arkham Asylum to one hundred percent. Move. 
Hey, Phoenix, you want to read? Oh, yes, I, I suppose I should, shouldn't uh, I? Uh, mm. I don't think I did Arkham City to 100%, but I think I did Arkham Asylum to 100%. Yeah. I've never played any of the Batman games. They're such good games. They really are. They, uh, they I've only are... played that VR one that you had me play here. If you, you, if, if you can, I would recommend getting the Arkham games, because they're very good games. Aside from it being Batman, they just play very well, and the stories in them are really good. But the the nice thing about them is they not necessarily Ar- Arkham Asylum didn't have the side quests. Nice. Uh, vegetable thing. Ooh, sounds interesting. But, I have to make a recipe soon. But Arkham City had a shit ton of side quests. That, okay. I mean, they... So it was more like an open world? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 it's open oh, yeah. world and you can do so many things. It's really cool. It, it is. And, yeah. And the same with Arkham Origins. What was neat about Arkham Origins? Well, well, it me, wasn't meant to be a long game. I believe the VR game was no, meant. No, the VR game was not meant to be long. No, the VR game was meant to be like a, I want to say like a kind of like how, a um, a quest for booty was like a short game between Tools of Destruction and Cracking Time. A quest for booty. Yeah. <laughs> That's what it's called. Okay. The Arkham, Arkham, Ark, Arkham, Arkham VR was meant to be between like Arkham City and Arkham Asylum, or sorry, Arkham Knight. Yeah. <laughs> Quest for booty. The disc is over there. Would you like to see it? <laughs> I keep calling it pirate booty. Yeah, me too. Pirates are in it, so pirates are in it. It was oh funny because God, it's so she funny. was young when we got that game. Oh she, my God. We started playing it, and then I was playing it, and then she's like, I gotta take She Then she fell asleep, and like two hours later, she woke up, and I'm like, the ending credits were on the screen. Yeah! <laughs> so I, 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 Ow. I go like, didn't remember. that in like three hours. I'm like, okay. <laughs> I didn't remember a quest for booty, and I'm like, yeah, it's a Ratchet and Clank mini <laughs> That's I got lost. I got stuck. I handed the controller to her, proceeded to fall asleep, and it's like, oh, hey, end credits. Yeah, that was funny. <laughs> yeah, I guess, you know. So, so, so maybe tonight we can play this. What's that one? Silent Hill. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Actually, while I'm standing, I'm going to work my teeth. Survival Horror at its best. Bullshit! <laughs> Sorry, cough in my throat. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Includes Silent Hill 2 and 3. Hmm. So you could try this if you want. Hmm? If you want to stream tonight, because if not, she can stream. Because I'm trying to get that schedule in, but. I played Silent Hill 2. So we can try number 3, maybe. You'll play, though. Oh, I will, will I? See? <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. You, you want to play that one. <laughs> not because... It's, it's st- <laughs> not because I'm scared. No, 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 no. no. Just, you need to experience the controls. And if you've played Silent Hill, don't say anything about the controls. Thank you. Yeah, I've never. You should just experience the controls. <laughs> Are the controls ass? No. It took her about 45 minutes to get out of the bathroom. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm assuming the controls really suck. You just need to experience the... You know, those games are experienced with controls. And, uh, yeah. If the controls suck, I'm probably not going to enjoy it too much. Oh. No, but, but, uh, that's why I say we should do Silent Hill 2, because... He just needs to experience the joy of the main character in Silent Hill 2. Which one was that one? Let's follow the blob! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Let's follow the blob, yeah. Why would you follow... (laughs) Yeah, Uh, you hear this evil screech, and he's like, let's follow that sound. (laughs) Let's not and say we did. Exactly! (sighs) That would be my feeling. 
why would you want to follow a screech that you hear and in some or did he see the sat- shadow creature too? He watched it. He watched it go down a road. He's like, oh, let's follow it. And first of all, in the first game, he's looking for his wife. Okay? He's looking for his wife who died. The wife's dead. Yeah. The wife's dead. He gets a letter saying, hey, come here. It's like, I'm just going to hit my car and I'm going to leave and call it good, okay? I'd be like getting out of the town and then I'd see this town. I'd be like, you know what? I love you, wife. Have a blast. You're dead. I'm going home. You're dead. I'm going home. I'll be right back. Yeah, you show up to that place and you see Silent Hill the way it is. You'd be like, she's dead. Turn around. Go back. <laughs> I love you dearly. But actually, technically, she's not dead, is she? I don't know. I don't know. If I Also, would... a lot of the speedrunners who play the game Moonwalk. It's faster. <laughs> but I don't... Moonwalk? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> But I don't. You can moonwalk in the game. Think, yes. I don't think like, that I, she is dead. Okay. I don't. I just think she's on a different plane. I don't know. Actually, can you hear me, Mister? Right. I need to kill because in the a movie, reaper with PlayStation VR. Uh, v- uh, it is not compatible with VR, Subnautica. Oh, okay. oh Subnautica. Do you know how? Okay, now that would be terrifying. Yes, yes. some of are already are. terrifying as is. No, it's not. not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. I think. Yes, that would be terrifying. <laughs> I use it when I brush my teeth, so I don't get toothpaste in my hair. Because I have any left. I got toothpaste in my hair. I'm like, what's this sticky stuff in my hair? Okay. Okay. Play the game. Yeah, but you're gonna probably gonna have lines. You can voice my over two voice. Uh huh. I see. Mm, quite. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. The document requesting me to be your attorney, of course. But what's wrong? Right game with rules. If it gives prep time.
right hand side. Oh god, what did I just do? There we go. So Elgato. Where I can see like the sound going yeah. up and down. Yeah. yeah. Uh, do I just slide it down? Is that any better? So I can turn it down more if need be. Okay, good. There we go. I won't mess with it anymore. I don't want to mess up anything. <laughs> Give a shout out to... To who? So I had to turn down some of the Elgato sound because Galaxy said uh, the it was too loud. So. Like, who's pig? And it was Phantom Lum Gamer. Oh. She's, she just, uh, she said PLG. Um. <laughs> okay. Put it on your shoulder. Cool. He's awesome, so I don't blame you. Funny enough, I wore my retainer last night. And my retainer didn't come out, but he normally does. Oh, that's a good thing, right? <laughs> why is the controller on your shoulder? I'm weird. Why are you? I mean, this is true. Why are you questioning me? <laughs> you know what? You're right. I I shouldn't be questioning you. I I should know by now that you just do strange and weird things. Thanks. Did you bring your shirt over? Uh, it's in the car. Okay. I don't know if it needs to be charged or not. Well, we have things. Oh no, I've got my charging. Oh god! Stop yawning. I have the uh, the charging cord in there. I just don't know if this switch needs to be charged. Oh. Well. But, yeah. What in the world happened? 
happened in that room yesterday? So, Maya gave us this, like, um, talisman thing and said, present it to Pearly, and she'll... Oh, Magatama? Uh, yes, the Magatama. Yeah. Yes. And she said, give that to Pearly, who I'm, I'm assuming Pearl, Pearl, and she will lend us her uh, powers or something, or <laughs> something like that. Yeah, he lost another mini sub. Welcome, Pizza. Pizza Jojo Mozzarella. Pizza Jojo's Mozzarella. Welcome to the stream. How's your day going? This is actually the second one, just as for all. Because the first one we already did, and my god, that last one took forever. Read. I know, I know. It took forever. You don't need to dwell on it. <laughs> you know, if if you were, if you didn't constantly go on about dwelling, like, your raps, it would have gone on a lot quicker, right? Wait, what? You were. I think like during that entire time, you're like, oh, I'm so tired. Like, you don't think if you did that, you would? I think it would have gone on a lot. It would have been shorter. No, it wasn't that. That trial literally took forever. Oh no, yeah, the last episode. I mean, no, yeah, the the la no, I mean the whole last trial, not just the last episode. Oh, I know. My god, that took forever. Uh, the meditation room nurtures all mediums, young and old. Even mediums are training, I'd wager. But it's pretty deserted today. Probably because of the murder yesterday. Now we can look inside. Mm -hmm. Play a manor, channeling chamber. <sighs> Looks like Detective Gumshoe is in here today. I like this music too. I should take this chance and thoroughly check this room. If I'm lucky, I might uncover a clue or two. Oh, Mr. Wright. Good morning. I'm on my way to meet. Go meet Miss. Mystic, I, was, I thought it was Miss Maya. <laughs> Mystic Maya. And I thought to bring her some items to make her feel more at home. Mainly, namely tea so bitter you lose your tongue and jaw dropping large strawberry desserts. I'm sure Maya will be very grateful. That's Mystic Maya, good sir. Uh, she's one scary lady. Oh dear, sweet Mystic Maya. Pro wept constantly you for you last night, as did I. I know it's important for me to search the site. I should ask her some questions too. Well, I have the chance. I would like to ask you a few questions about what happened yesterday. Do you mean the awful tragedy? <clears throat> yes, that. That man murdered me, so I killed him. Yeah, that was all yesterday. Yes. Well. Her hair is just way too crazy. I'm sorry. It's better than Salmonella's. Yes. Yeah, I guess. Okay. Yeah. What happened here in this room after I left? Well, first I struck Mystic Maya on the head. To make her go unconscious, correct? That is correct. Next, I perform the spirit severing technique. The spirit severing technique? That must be important. The spirit of the nurse that was inside Mystic Maya's body. I use that to the, the, te the, the technique to send her back to the other world. I wonder if this kind of testimony is even admissible in a court of law. By the way, what is this room exactly? The channeling chamber? This room, this room was created for the sole purpose of preventing such tragedy as yesterday. What do you mean? Sometimes when in, when inexperienced mediums calls an, express, an especially strong spirit, that spirit may become violent and revolt as you witnessed yesterday. Revolt? But how? When a spirit enters a, a medium's body, she loses her will and she steps aside. To put another to put another way, the spirit is borrowing the medium's body. But isn't that extremely dangerous? 
An experienced medium, medium has little problem with controlling the spirit. But Maya, uh, I mean... Da, 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 But Maya, I mean, mystic Maya. That was her first channeling. <laughs> and that's why I insisted on locking the door. However, I never thought I would be calling Major upon the client himself. I'm grateful that one of our heirlooms was not damaged in a horrible incident. And that would be... The folding screen there. It is the Curian Sacred Writings. Curian? 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 Potato, potato. <sighs> Along with the Curian Sacred Urn. Curian. They may be the village's most uh, treasured possessions. Evil as hell, the Queen of Hearts. <laughs> If I ever found out that something had happened to either of one, oh, the humanity. Odd for her to be worrying about the folding screen at a time like this. Guess it isn't just some dilapidated old screen after all. So, how is Pearl today? Mr. Wright? Yes? In this world, Pearl is my most treasured possession. When compared to even Mystic Maya, Pearl has the spiritual power to become a master. That's very impressive. Until now, the women of a branch family have thought themselves to be inferior. But Pearl is different. Her spiritual, her spiritual strength is great, even greater than some of the main family. Yes, Pearl is channeling a channeling prodigy and is the pride of the branch family. Wow. She's really fired up now. She could have done something to Maya. Maybe lit one less candle than there should have been. Put Maya in jail so Pearl could take over and become master. Yeah. 3D audio. Yeah. So oh, is that like if, if like, it's if like it's, the left? Okay. Yep, 3D audio. Yeah. But oh actually, god, I don't, I it don't would think make there's... it even more real being able to hear a reaper in every direction. Well, in Sub-Zero, I don't think there are reapers. I don't think so. I don't know what's in Below Zero, so I kind of have just haven't seen anything in the game. I know that there's there's uh, more the, land the, the, creatures. The, yes, yes, yes. Don't talk about it. I would like to be surprised with that game. <laughs> okay. I know there's I know of one thing that you're not going to like. Yeah, Leviathan. Oh, no, not that. Oh? No, you said to keep it a secret. No, 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 no. no. Just remember, my dear boyfriend, um, if ever something scary happens, I pass it to you. I think I'll let you play this one. No, you're playing it too. Oh, well, you won't know, actually, until something happens. Yes, so... <laughs> <laughs> In Sub Zero, uh, yeah, you you. Uh... I know Marjorie's still alive. Who? She's one of the people in the Degasi. Oh yeah, her, but no, not not her. Um, it's a certain animal, like a creature. I know there's but... scary shit in the game. But yeah, you. you, you uh, no, I won't say anything more. Don't worry, mm. you'll be playing the game too. Yeah, but no, nah, I'm I'm not gonna say anything. Please no, don't. No, no I'm, yeah. Please don't. Your turn to read. Oh, did you read that? I one? already read that. In any case, our world is so different from yours. Perhaps it is best for you to quit, good sir. You mean a carrot? I don't like carrots. They're good for your eyesight. I don't like carrots. I'm picky with carrots. I'll have one. They're not my favorite thing in the world. I'll have like one like every once in a while. But... I, oh, I will hello. actively search for them. <laughs> the 
blood. Blood. This is one of the medium sets, I assume. Oh, okay. I already, I already read this. Oh, you did. Oh. Alright. I already looked through the one, though. Oh, I never noticed there. In. Someone could have been hiding in there. Shot. That could have been the second shot. Uh huh. <laughs> uh huh? It's a hole. Could this have been made by a bullet? I do believe it is time for me to take my leave. Alright. Please tell Maya I said hi. What was that? Uh, I mean... Mr. Maya. Don't sound so patronizing, young man. <laughs> I will tell her. I've already read all this. At least we found a bullet hole in that, though. Well, I think it's good. But that's the iron door. Uh, have a look at the door. Uh, but I managed to break it. Let's do something that not people can do the most amazing things. That is true. Oh. Winding way. That's where I was trying to go. <laughs> I just shut the wrong one. Little Pearl isn't here today. Maybe she's at school? Why didn't you examine the area? I examined it. Huh? I examined it already. Did you find anything in there? I don't, it, I think everything happened in the room. Or, uh... Yeah, but that doesn't mean it didn't happen outside of the room. What is it? No, 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 no. Dentist guy? Oh, hey, like, you're that guy from yesterday. That a uh, dentist guy? <laughs> no, I mean, I'll listen. The winding way was in the meditation apartment. Oh, the channeling chamber, only one entrance. No, no, I'm a lawyer. That's right, um, Mr. Smith, Esquire? <laughs> That's right. Wait, I mean, you're wrong. My name is right. Smith, right. Well, I ain't got like three letters at least. I don't think she gets the point. I don't think she gets fucking anything. Anyway, why are you here? So, uh, oh. That was my line, but Sorry. anyway. <laughs> so, like, I say this thing called parapsychology. Yeah, it's, it's, it's uh, ecology, and it's the study of parademons. <laughs> um, you told me about that yesterday. The sesame allergy, too. What I'd really like to know is why you're still here today. Oh, so, like, that's what you meant. Like, you should have been more, like, clear about things. Sorry. My bad. No, it's okay. Like, it's really... That's it? Why'd you stop mid-sentence? Did I? Huh. So, like... What was I talking oh, about again? Jesus. <laughs> She's not worse than April May. No one's worse than April May. This girl's fucking... Clueless or is playing. His salmonella is my April May. I hated her. She's either legit clueless or she's playing clueless. Well, the boss will. Not I ever wanted another genuine mysterious phenomenon. It's right here. Yeah, no shit. Oh, 
pieces of chain and lost pieces of bottle. Hmm. You left the blanket a mess. Are you going to hold it? Like, I had a really good nap, and I, like, I was thinking of leaving it like that, so, like, all is set for tonight. Sure. You didn't examine that statue back there? I did, it's just a mirror statue. Decorative wooden statue. Curian village is hard of channeling. Isn't it cute? I like totally brought that or bought that. Ah, so it's yours, huh? Yeah, so like this village is really famous for like channeling and bears. <laughs> Wait, famous for bears? But it's like, okay. If you ever, like, see a bear, you just play dead, and then, like, leave you alone. <laughs> is that right? Yeah, cause, like, fighting back is totally of no use. <laughs> she actually tried to fight one? You, you poke him in the nose. Or the eye. Pop him in the nose. Pop him in the just nose. Just boop the snoot. No, you pop him in the nose and kick him in the chest. Oh, that's what I Yeah, you just boop the snoot. But no, with a bear, you can actually hold your ground. If you know what you're Just, doing. If they run towards you, stand your ground, because then you're making it look like you're not prey. Hmm. So they run towards you, they'll stop. And eventually, hopefully, they'll walk away. But don't make any sudden, quick movements until the bear is out of sight. Yeah. Because if you do, then they will say, oh, they are prey, I'm gonna go and kill them even now. Personally, I never want to see a bear in the woods. I know they have adorable paws, though. <laughs> I mean, if it's a black bear, you're probably gonna be fine. Because black bears are usually not aggressive. Aren't the grizzly bears the worst? Or is it polar bears the worst? Grizzlies. Polar bears? I mean, the polar bears. Which is probably they... never gonna come across a polar bear here or maybe. Exactly. Grizzly bears, too, unless so, like, you go maybe farther up north, or it's Canada, maybe? I don't know. Polar bear? No, 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 grizzly bear. <laughs> but. Um... They, oh, no, I know. You, you can see a polar bear in Maine, in the zoo. Or, or do we do have polar bears in zoos? We actually live one. There used to be one in there. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> but I think that one is long dead. Probably. Yeah. So, why are you still here today? Like, there's so much for me to, like, study here. Like the medium's training, or like how they inherit their spiritual power. I suppose the spirit is the real thing after all. So like, I asked if I could stay here for like a little longer. She sure seems like the carefree type, at least on the surface. Have you heard about the murder? It's like totally scary. She says with a silly smile, plastered on her. So, do you know anything about it that might help? No, not really. Somehow, I don't think she has a grip on reality. Oh, what's going on here? About the victim, Dr. Gray. I don't know who you're talking about, man. Like, wait, I think you asked about it like yesterday, too. That's right. <laughs> Reaction yesterday with the mask was. Other, right? I don't know when Dr. Gray. Yeah, she's faking. Oh, yeah. She's hiding. I don't know if she's necessarily a killer, but she's hiding something. <laughs> oh, absolutely she is. But that was the same thing with April May. She wasn't the killer, but she was working with Red and White. 
She was working with Quark. Hmm. I wonder if we're gonna meet Dr. Hadi though. <laughs> No. Okay, she's definitely hiding something from me. Like, is something wrong? <laughs> ah! You surprised me. And how are you today? She isn't open to friendly chatting. Huh? She's still holding something in her hand. Looks like the same thing she had yesterday. Dr. Hunt heard of the... Take that! Oh yeah. Maya said to give this to you. Yeah. Uh, I'm in trouble now. If Morgan sees us like this, I'll be the next one they're channeling. <laughs> That's- Oh. Uh, uh, yeah, but you can- I didn't realize that that was <laughs> her line. That's- that's Mystic Maya's! Uh-huh. She, she actually spoke. Who are you? I'm Phoenix Wright. I, uh, worked with Maya. You worked with Mystic Maya? You- you're Mr. Nick, aren't you? You're- Uh, excuse me? I thought I know who she picked Nick up from. I know who you are. You're you're Mystic Maya's special someone. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. Eight. Right. <clears throat> he's a he's, he's thirty. Or was 35? Turning gray. <laughs> he looks so much older than that. What? So then, of course, you're gonna help Mystic Maya, aren't you? That, that, that's what you're gonna do, right? Well, yeah, I will. Oh, wow. It's like a beautiful fairy tale. Oh, I don't, I don't like salsa. I've never had it, but I, I, I don't like spicy or, or salty. Nah, nah, I'm good though. You don't like salty? No, spicy. Oh. The earliest look shining brightly in your eyes. It must be true love. <laughs> what? Why am I being boiled into a bright red lobster by this little kid? I'm so jealous of Mystic Maya. Ah, a wonderful, what a wonderful relationship. Wait, I, uh, <laughs> I mean, uh, we aren't, things aren't right. <laughs> I can tell you're a good person. All right, Mr. Nick. And maybe small, but I'm going to help you in any way I can. Oh, good. Pearl, are you friends with Maya? This is corny? Like the salsa or the game? I feel very grateful to be friends with her. She's so great. <laughs> um, I want to be like Mystic Maya when I grow up. I, I, I really, uh, really look up to her. Wow. I had no idea Maya was so revered. Usually people don't like it. Like, uh, usually people don't use Mystic Maya's title. I get mad. Oh. Sorry. But if it's you, Mr. Nick, then it's okay. <laughs> because, because you're special to her. <laughs> At least she's legal now. <laughs> Maya? She's 18 now. Salda? Salsa. world did she get an idea like that? By the way, this may be rude, but which channeling school are you from? Which channeling school? Yes, for example, I study at the Kurain 
Jirian technique. Jirian. 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 Ah, I get it. No, no, no. I'm a lawyer. A lawyer. L lawyer? Yep. A lawyer. Is that related? Is that related to spirit? Spirit mediums in any way? Um, none that I know of. Kinda, there was that one case. Which case? Can I advice? They took in Maya, uh, Mia and Maya's mother to try and jail the dead guy. Oh, gotcha. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we haven't gotten to that case? No, we did that case. That was the case about Miles. Uh, they, they, they brought um, in Misty Fay. Oh, yeah, Misty. Oh, that's right. Yep. Gotcha. Okay. Wait, right. are you telling me you don't know what a lawyer is? I'm sorry, <laughs> but I, I have no idea. I did say Pearl doesn't know much about the outside world. So what's that you've got there, Pearl? Oh, this? I found it yesterday. <laughs> hmm. If you want, I can give it to you. Yes, please. Sure. Alright. Well, if you really want to give it to me. You look like a child at a toy store, Nick, uh, Mr. <laughs> Nick. She not only speaks in a fine manner, but laughs in one, too. Oh, the... Yeah, this is the key to the chamber. And I thought there was only one. Well, Maya could have dropped it and she picked it up. Or unless the mother has could be there could be multiple. Uh Mr. Nick? Yes, Pearls? I can call you that, right? You're too cute to just call you Pearl. Sure, Nick. Sure, Mr. Nick. Um Are you sure it's okay to give me <coughs> it's for me to have this Magatama? Yeah, it's okay. I was told to give it to you. But I can't accept something like this. All I really should do is change uh all I really should do is charge his Magatama with spiritual energy. Spiritual energy? Oh, okay. Please take this. I'm sure it will be helpful. What do you mean? It will let you see people's secrets. What? <laughs> see people's secrets? Yes. Yeah. It's alright with you. I would like to accompany you for a little while. I can explain the Magitama's <coughs> power to you when we meet someone hiding a secret. Aha! Uh -huh. Excuse me. <clears throat> Gotta go back and talk to her. Her mother's not gonna be happy with us in the slightest! Judge <laughs> <laughs> Kimber? <laughs> Unless he's making a whore member's membership. Whore <laughs> <laughs> member's <laughs> 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 Or members premium. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, nice, nice. This is your official membership. Wait, is Subnautica below zero L? May 14th. Galaxy was like, they released the Galaxy. Uh, he messaged me, he showed me the trailer. I'm like, oh, yeah, I know it's coming out on May 14th. He's like, how? So, yeah, I saw the trailer a while ago. <laughs> um, but he saw the PlayStation trailer. Um, he saw a PlayStation trailer. I saw the. It was the same company that made um, the is it's made from the Dark Anth the Dark Anthology series. Oh really? They released a trailer for it. Ooh, nice. Hello again. We seem to be seeing a lot of each other today. Ah, sorry. Ah, she looks like totally cute. Is she like your daughter? What? No. How old do you think I am? I'm gonna ask you about the victim, Dr. Gray. I like, I totally don't know him, man. Okay. Yo, what? Yo. What is that? You can see it, can't you, Mr. Nick? You, you can see the lock on the person's heart. Huh? What? This is the power of the Magatama. 
Only you can see the Psylocke's night, Mr. Psyche. Psy Psyche. Psy would just be Yeah, I've, I've seen the penguins. The more someone wants to hide their secret, the more locks you will see. If it's only one, then you can easily unlock it. Unlock? But how? Please use Mystic Minus Mangatama on this person. Let's remove the lock. I have no idea what she's talking about, but I guess I'll give it a try. You must be careful though, Mr. Nick. If you make a mistake, you will, it will hurt you. Come again? <laughs> if you don't think you have proof, you, you must stop. Uh, you must have the courage to stop. Well, I've got to start somewhere. I'm a sure. Psych lock thing a try. I'm sure if um they know PS5 is coming out, we'll have a PS5 upgrade. So if it's not on PS4, they'll have it on PS5. I'm gonna ask you again. Did you know Dr. Gray? I like totally, to I like totally know, don't know that guy. Like you're totally more persistent than a roach. This girl is hiding something. I'm sure of it. I guess I have no choice but to remove this lock. Alright, so first I have to use Maya's Magatama. Oh. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't... I don't know. I don't think she's evil. Eeny meeny. I believe you do know who Dr. Gray is. Know. I told you, like, how many times do I, like, have to repeat myself? If you're, like, so totally sure, then where's your proof? Well, it may be possible that you never actually met Dr. Gray in person. I do believe you might have at least indirectly known like, what do you mean? Like, indirectly? Are you trying to mind meld with me? What? I'm actually going for somebody. I'm actually chan- um, The voice of music for her is actually, like, I'm actually going for someone that was actually in the Scooby-Doo episode. Okay. She was like, she, um, she was like this very, like, chill- Actually, she ended up being the mask on the mask people. But she was like this, like, very chill person, you know, like, shaggy man or whatever. <laughs> Total heavy. Her name is Shannon. Like... Oh yeah, Galaxy. I can do a Scooby-Doo voice and a Shaggy voice as well. Yes, you said that. <sighs> I should try to show that the possibility existed for now. Something that shows a possible connection. I, I did see the Sonata trailer. It was pretty funny. Well, we have to do it, but I don't know what to do. Did you show her the key? Nope. Okay. 
Okay, um... the planet is the guy on four I don't think it's the guy in the first section of the planet. Ah. Hey, it's you, pal. So you're going to be her lawyer, I bet? Yes. Oh. oh. I really feel bad for you, pal. Just this once, I wish I could be on your side. Detective Gumshoe? Yeah, but I shouldn't be saying that kind of stuff to you. Shouldn't? Hey, you're a cute kid. <laughs> I'm not scary. Honest. He's a big teddy bear. Oh, I don't know Gumshoe liked kids. But hey, I know. I'll show you something cool. How's this? It's a re It's a real genuine pistol. Detective Gumshoe! What are you doing showing her something that dangerous? Oh, sorry. Because I also want to finish Game of Thrones. Yeah, well, let's go. Let's go show two. I want. I just want to get past this stuff so we can go like or get much as get close to the trial. All right, fair. Well, I know you want to be Game of Thrones. I think it's going to be interesting. Like I don't mind going in the rain, but I don't want to go if it's raining because I have other plans. Because it did say it was supposed to rain today. Well, you can just check out. Well, I believe in this. I believe in below zero, it's a woman. It is. You also need to Oh, yeah. What about Maya and the charges against her? I don't think you can win, pal. If you're talking about proof. <laughs> yeah, you're talking to us. <laughs> True. You've got proof? Yeah, pal. That puppy haired photographer is going to testify tomorrow. I knew she was going to testify. <laughs> I knew she was going to testify. Yeah, but in the actual demo, you play as a woman. So in the game, you're actually going to be a woman. I've seen the game, that's why I know it's a woman. Yeah. You must be talking about Lada. Actually, speaking of Lada. I took some odd pictures earlier. Oh yeah, they already... I know. Lada's hot pictures. Oh, the one she captured or something? Besides, you must have realized by now, Val. There's no way anyone other than Maya Fey could have done it. What am I supposed to say to Pearls now? <laughs> Wait, we have a little follower. Huh? We have a little follower. Oh yeah, Pearls. About Dr. Gray. The victim wasn't super famous, but people still knew who he was. His face was all over those tabloid shows last year. Really? Yeah, the demo actually made the game look really nice. Okay. It seems like it's gonna be cool. I was looking through some newspapers from last year, and... 
Huh? Could have sworn I had... I cut an article out, but I guess I must have lost it. He's searching for the pockets. Boy, are those big. Yeah. Hmm. Looked really interesting, too. Hey, do you have a copy, pal? A copy of that article? Dr. Gray might have brought a copy to the office when he came by. That could be what we need to unlock her Mayor. thing, possibly. Um, Mayor. About Maya's trial tomorrow. I've got two pieces of news for you, pal. Two? Yeah. Bad news? Even mm -hmm. worse news. So which do you want to hear first? I don't really care. It doesn't change the fact that I'm not gonna like it. Alright, pal. The prosecutor for the trial is Prosecutor <laughs> Von Karma. What? Von Karma? <laughs> Karma is an awe-inspiring veteran prosecutor. Take it! I'm <coughs> sorry. You're not wrong. Cough my throat. He lost the case in 40 years of his career and raised a fearsome disciple. Hi! Uh, Never forget. But we took him down! He did, and he lost his first case. Wait a sec. Didn't Von Karma stand trial and... That's where the other piece of bad news comes in. Oh. Von Karma you're facing tomorrow is actually his successor. Oh, great. <laughs> it's been her. Yeah. Successor. I'm not gonna be useless! <laughs> His successor. So, um, who is this successor, Von Karma? Literally, pal, it's Prosecutor Von Karma's kid. His kid became a prosecutor really young, like 13. What? He's lost trial since. That's what they call a prodigy, pal. 13? Oh no, that's it's not the whole game. It's it's a demo. It should just be a demo. Yeah, there should like a little like I think like what was it what thirty minutes of footage like thirty minutes of gameplay? Because uh... I think it's literally just the girl and she's talking to someone on the boy. Um, um, she's talking to somebody, and then she goes into the ice caves. It collapses. She has to leave, and she ends up in the water. I think that's all it is. No, there was. More than that. That's all I saw of it. I didn't think it was long. <laughs> hmm. Kid, huh? Wait a sec. Thirteen? The kid became a prosecutor at the age of thirteen? I mean, a prodigy like that, I would have heard something about... Oh, no, no. The kid was born and raised in Germany, pal. That country's got a lot of stuff and it's a great place to develop person's talents. Yeah. Well, I think it's. I think it's. So I think Below Zero is doing the same thing as Subnautica did. They released the game on certain platforms like Xbox and. Um, Maybe. Well, they released it early, and then they would do updates for it, like they would do it on the computer. So you so you could play the game as the updates went on. Germany, huh? How have I have never heard of this person? Takes is mentioning the name Von Karma. <laughs> so they have a nasty actor in someone's mouth. I get terrible flashbacks of, to that case. Uh. Yeah, no, 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 I know that. But it's, like I said, the same thing with Subnautica. Um, they probably released the game and then they've been slowly updating the game. Until the actual release <laughs> date. Oh! that Well, that's probably a good thing that you didn't cut it off. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you could call it a beta. <sighs> Miles! Stop it. Get a grip on yourself, Phoenix. None of that matters anymore. Von Karma. Okay. Move. Okay. Kyrian Village. 
green. Is Pearl still with us? I don't know. Phew. Feels like I've been gone forever. It's only been one day. Oh, that's right. Where's that newspaper Dr. Gray brought to brought the other day? Ah, here it is. Right on top of my desk. This is the only thing I left behind that's going to be of any help. Oh. this over to my office the other day. Hey! It's that news story. The one about the malpractice suit. Ooh. Fourteen patients died and it caused a huge stink. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, but that's not all, pal. Things only got worse after that. Really? You mean the car accident the nurse died in? Hmm. Oh, here we go. I brought my own clipping with me today. Here, pal. This is for you. Alright, thanks. Hmm. Look me, at the name. Me. Yeah, yeah. Uh, winding. Move. We're back! Eeny meeny, miny mo. Eeny meeny and. Meeny? Miny meeny. Because they had the same last name. No, I know. The... Yeah. Meeny meeny, I don't know. Yeah. Blah blah blah. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. Well, I think I got Sonata on Xbox, so maybe I, I don't know if they did it on Xbox. I maybe they didn't. Honestly, I think Subnautica, Subnautica Below Zero would make really good co-op games. But they're not going to do co-op games. They've said that they're not going to do multiplayer. Oh, I know. I think they would make really fun co-op games, like Subnautica and Below Zero, both just having two players surviving together. That would be really fun. Well, if her sister was the nurse. She could have been pissed that she could have been he killed my sister, so I'm gonna kill him. But I don't think she killed him. I, I think she's like one. I think she's one of those people that she's gonna probably go on stand or something. Okay. Take a look at this newspaper clipping. Like, what is it? A story about an accident? Please read the victim's name. Um, Mimi Mimi? Actually, it's Miney. So yeah. hers is Eeny Miney. And the other one's Mimi Miney. Eeny Miney. Miney Mo. So yeah, Eeny Miney and Mimi Miney. Let me guess, your father's Mo Miney. Anyways, read. Miney is a pretty rare last name, wouldn't you say? Miss Mimi Miney wouldn't happen to be a relative of yours, would she? Could be her sister or her mother. Something. This happened, what, 14 years ago? I don't know. So you noticed she, uh, she, she was my older sister. Sorry about your loss. Yeah, PC users, PC users always have the good shit. <laughs> Cause I have phasmophobia, I would love to play that. Oh, that looks so fun. <laughs> Your sister, is she a nurse? Perhaps at Dr. Gray's surgical clinic? Gray's surgical clinic. I don't think I need to tell you that the clinic was run by the victim, Dr. Turner Gray. Which is how you knew of Dr. Gray. You knew him through your sister. Yes.
Ooh, Ooh. it charged up. Please tell me all you know about Dr. Gray. Oh, oh sweet Jesus! Oh, what? Oh, my my sister's name was Mimi Miney. Fucking scary. Do you think? <laughs> she was like a nurse at Dr. Gray's clinic. That's what I thought. I heard that like Dr. Gray was really tough on people, like a total slave driver. <laughs> My sis was like always coming home and like, totally wiped out because she was like overworked. Uh, wiped out? So is that why she fell asleep at the wheel? That guy like drove my sister so hard, so like that's why the accident happened. Where 14 patients died from the practice. Yeah, like I think that that was the doctor's fault too. My sis was pushed by everyone, like I, uh, my sis was pushed by. Like, everyone's expectations? What? Oh, no, I was just like, what are you trying to say? And then I was reading, I'm like, oh. No, no, please continue. <laughs> are you sure? Mm-hmm. And, like, her duties and stuff. And that pushed her, like, to death. Oh, I'm sorry. I figured if I had a couple more likes, and I really got to the character. <laughs> so, like, are we done? I've, like, already told my story to, like, everyone. Do you understand that, Mr. Nick? This is how the Cyclop works. Oh, I'm not trying to keep this apart unless I absolutely need to. This lock, uh, the lock this time is pretty easy, but you might, well, you might meet people who aren't as willing to give up, give in later on. Well, I guess it makes sense uh, for developers give it to the PC users. I know. I mean, PCs are stronger power, uh, are stronger in power and hardware, and so getting the perfect, yeah, so, yeah, I, I know why it is, um, I know, because it's just easier for them to send it out, and they can kind of get, like, instant feedback, yeah. where, you know, because it's just computers, you know, you need to go through stream and everything, unlike with Xbox and PlayStation, where, PlayStation, where you need to go through, like, Microsoft, and you need to go through, um, thing, like, Microsoft and Sony, mm -hmm. or, or even Switch for that, or Nintendo, so, it's, you know, you don't need to worry about it. If you don't have enough proof, be careful and know when to stop trying. Uh. June 20th, Kyrian Village. Drain. Mr. Nick? Hmm? What's wrong? I have never left Kyrian Village. Drain. Really? Wow, that's um, pretty amazing. You're, you're gonna meet with Mystic Maya, aren't you? Please tell her I say hi. Hey, wait. She ran off. Again. Well, I know it is a secret now, but I still don't have any idea how I'm going to save Maya. I don't even know if I should go in there with a smile or a straight face. Detention center. What am I supposed to do? I'm almost out of time. Bullshit our way out of this! Yeah, pretty much. Can I really do anything? Can I really save her? Sorry to keep you waiting. Huh? It's been a long time. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Phoenix? Maya! That Mia! Voice. Oh shit, it is. Mia! I have to remember Mia's voice now. <laughs> Even without me being here, you still look like you've learned to stand on your own. Mia. She's Maya's older sister. Mentor. Oh no, I know that. I just prefer controllers, so I prefer console. She was a top notch defense lawyer, and a certain case forced her into retirement. But never had trouble. She comes to help just like this. Her spirit comes back from the other world and borrows Maya's body. 
Phoenix, you can't make that kind of face in front of your client. Only you're someone who smiles no matter how bad it gets, especially when it's especially when it's bad. Yeah. You can't smile at the end if you haven't been smiling the whole way there. In any case, the face you're making is uh, now is no face to show a client, Phoenix. But so tell me about all of it. I'm going to guess that my sister's in a lot of trouble again. I told her everything about what had happened in the last two days. Oh, exactly. Both have their pros and cons. Oh, absolutely. Like, for Sims, I'd much rather play it on the computer. I played it on Xbox and I got so frustrated with it. I see. Mia, what am I supposed to do? It's pretty clear what a good lawyer does in this situation. And that is? Bullshit. Tell me, please. Believe in your convictions. If you fight for the complete... And fight for the complete. And fight for the complete acquittal for your client. You think Maya's not guilty? How can you be so sure? I know she is. And I'll give you a hint as to why. Yes? Mediums can't have dreams. They can't? From what you told me, it sounds like... Maya was having a dream while channeling. Yeah. She said she dreamt that she had died and had been buried in the ground. But that is impossible. You've heard it from her, I'm sure, when, me when a medium channels, her own spirit disappears. Which means that it was impossible for her to dream during that time. Then, what does this mean? Oh yeah, consoles are definitely cheaper than computers. If especially if you want like, a really good, high-end gaming computer. I mean, that laptop for like $1,700. Or sorry, this laptop. You zone. But we needed a good laptop because it's like for like 3ds Mac. Or, like, or, True, like, and it is meant for like gaming and stuff. So. Oh. I think it's a safe bet that Maya was set up. A set up? It's up to you to blow the lid on this case tomorrow or show us a set up. How am I supposed to prove her innocence when I have nothing to go on? Well, if you're looking for a clue, uh, it's already in your hands. It is? Just as it sounds, Phoenix. You already hold the key. Really? Come on. Show me the key. Show me the key to the case. The key? Huh? Alright, I'll show it to her. The key. Mia, have you seen this key before? Ah, the key. It's literally the key to understanding everything that happens in this case. This key? Phoenix, listen. Right now, the key is sitting in your hands. However, it shouldn't be. It, contra it contradicts the facts. What does she mean? In certain, this key will be a piece of evidence that makes your case tomorrow. Of course you don't have to tell us. You already know everything you need to know. You know, the, you know what the key to this case is. That is enough. But, but, how can I win tomorrow without knowing who the real murderer is? Who could have... I didn't know it at the time. But this thing was going to end. It turned into surprising. What?! Oh. Mia? What? What's wrong? That's right. Only I can see the side box. What?! Mia must know something about the real murderer. It's Morgan Le Fay. Well, for this to be something that she would hide under lock and key from me. What is going on? It's Morgan Le Fay. Probably. Look, she does. Hey, look, it's that too. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it has to be Morgan Le Fay. Lafay? I thought it was just Faye. 
Oh, right, the character that did the spoofing. Mm -hmm. I forgot Morgan Le Fay. What? Ooh, we get to meet Francisca von Karma. Oh, sweet Jesus. She's a bitch. Oh, I'm sure she is. Just like her father? <sighs> oh, okay. Well, no, it's just like, it's more so I was confused. Like, who are you talking to? <laughs> like, who, like, who was it referencing? Alright, anyways. Thank you all for joining us today. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit follow. That way you get notified when we go live. Where, uh, I'm excited to see how this goes. It's gonna be interesting. Mm -hmm. I actually didn't intend on streaming this long, but we had people talking, so it wouldn't be that big of a deal. Um. Nice. I like these. We're going to see you next time. I'm not sure when I'm a thing tonight. Tonight, I think I might try to get him to play Silent Hill. Uh -huh. if, you know, if you know anything about Silent Hill, just don't say anything. I want him to experience the full controls. And how it took me 45 minutes to get out of the bathroom. Assuming, uh, assuming I'm going to hate it. Mary. That makes me think of this. <laughs> yes, make sure you hit follow. I'm a variety streamer, so you really never know what I'm gonna be streaming at any given time. Um, and I'm putting links in the chat, so make sure you join like Discord, YouTube, and stuff like that. My donation link's also there if you would like to donate, but it's not at all required. Um, no, who's live? Still on the Queen's Lair. Okay. So, I think we're gonna raid Queen Slayer Val. Wonderful streamer. Um, she's currently playing the Hunter or the Hunted or something? I look like the Hunter. The Hunter, Call of the Wild. Okay. Don't know what the game is, but, uh... Sounds like it's just about hunting, really. Just a hunting game. Oh. Jack said that I played it in its early stages of the game. There we go. Alright, so when you get through to your hashtag big for make sure you follow her. She has a lot of cool names. I think she has, like, Valorant or something like that, so... Make sure you check her out. Anyways, have a good day. We'll see you all tonight, maybe, or my mom will be streaming tonight. We'll see what happens with it. So, have a good night, guys. Bye, everybody.